along to another mega walk. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous day here in Tenerife, as you can see. Uh, drove past and it was 27 degrees on uh, some of the signs. Gorgeous day, got a little bit of a sea breeze going on. Uh, but we're going to take a walk all the way from here, Los Cristianos, all the way to uh, Del Duque is where we're uh, going to be picking up the car. So we're going to walk through Las Americas, we're going to go through um, Costa Adeki, Fania Bay, have a look at all the beaches. Uh, we're also planning on a little lunch stop, we have come straight from work. Yeah. Um, we're planning on a little bit of a lunch and coffee stop at uh, Beer Garden Tenerife as well in San Eugenio. Um, so plenty to come, it's going to be a long one guys. Uh, if you're watching on Catch Up as well, thank you very much uh, for joining us. And hopefully this uh, brings you a little bit of uh, sunshine. The last one we did of these had nearly 60,000 views. So I know it was popular and uh, a lot of people ask for it. So here we go. We're going to go and do it again. About three hours of walking, live streams and fun. So thank you very much for joining us. Let me spin this around. Just show you this, the view you get with the blue skies behind. I just love this little section. I love starting the lives here amongst all these palm trees. It's a uh, gorgeous view. We'll uh, let Laura finish up oh, grabbing her phone. There you go. Okay, so we're going to head down onto the uh, beachfront here. Afternoon, uh, Paul. Hi, everyone. Una, Tracy. Hi, guys. Thank you for joining. Oh, we've lost Laura already. <laughs> She's coming. Uh, afternoon, all. So yeah, nice long walk, good stretch of the legs, will do us good. Bit of exercise, yeah. Yeah. And you'll get to see exactly how busy it is, it's now March. So we'll see if you notice any difference compared to when we did it a month or so ago. I think it was over a month ago since we uh, did the, this, the mega walk last time. Uh, thank you for another lovely live, thank you very much. Strap yourselves in. <laughs> Try not to get run over. As you walk along, I did. Uh, we've parked the car up in. We've dropped a car off in a decky for us to walk to to come back in. Uh, and the Sunday market was on, uh, just near the GF Grand there. And a decky was very, very busy. Uh, the, nice little parking spot just about. Yeah, you just about got a space. I say Sunday market. It's the the Thursday market over there in a decky, but it was busy. Good to see. It is hot today, 27 it was saying on some of the things. I've just, in the car there it said 25, so it's a lovely warm day. We'll go past a few more of those little indicators, so we'll see. Yeah, we'll see what they say. It's normally the pharmacies that have them on, yeah. isn't it? We'll uh, have a look at those as we go. A nice lunch break surprise. Thanks very much, Amy. I hope your lunch break is about three or four hours long. <laughs> um, was meant to be flying out on Saturday, but had to cancel due to illness. Oh, that's a shame, Natalie. Uh, make sure you get it rebooked. Hope everything's okay there. It's, uh, got to put a few things before holidays, unfortunately. So we've got plenty of action as soon as we hit the beachfront here. Uh, we've got, I can see the Berry Yali going out, which is a whale and dolphin trip. You've got the traveling lady going out as well. We've got divers in the water. We've got kayakers in the water. It's, uh, the water looks stunning today. It's lovely and clear, lovely and clear. Got a bit of a breeze, as you can see with these. You might hear it a little bit down the microphone. We have got our fluffy cover on. It is lovely down there. This, if you're wondering, okay, is our brand new Brett Free backpack. Is absolutely amazing. I'm gonna quickly mention it. Um, they have uh, teamed up with us. They have gifted us this rucksack but I absolutely love it. It's an American company, uh, but it's all sectioned off in the backpack. So if you've got camera equipment and stuff, it's all sectioned. I'll quickly show you it. Let Laura show you the, can you show them the segments on it? Yeah. So we've got this little, and do you know what? The so all the little, for me, I've got all my different wires and things when we go away. I absolutely love it. Everything it arrived yesterday. I've been waiting for uh, for weeks for it, and you've got all sectioned. I've got my sticks in there, my um, battery pack for when we go low on battery later. So, got little compartments on the sides here. Ooh. 
There you go, we've got a full tour from Laura here. <laughs> There's all, yeah, extra segments for your cameras and stuff. They are absolutely amazing. Um, so see us using that, plenty around. Got our uh, waters in the top there, well, Aquarius, of course. Laptop goes in the bag. It's a perfect travel day bag, that. Just got nowhere to travel to, eh? So, yeah, if you are so if you are interested in that rucksack, there is a link in the description. Um, there is a Night Strider code. You can get 10% off. Um, but I absolutely love it. It's uh, going to be a great addition, that. Looking forward to it. Hi, are you okay? I'm fine, thank you. Sure. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for getting back here. No problem. You. you having a good time? Yeah. yeah. Hello to everyone in Glasgow. Enjoy there you go, the Glasgow. Uh, Thank you very much. Thank you very Have much. a great day. Okay, there we go. So, do you have a. There is loads of colours on there. Absolutely loads. It took lifetime me. Warranty. Lifetime warranty. as Laura says. 4,005 star reviews. There you go. Um, no, it is genuinely excellent. I get offered various things, and a lot of them I don't accept, but that is absolutely fantastic. For our travel days, but if you go on the website, there is. I, I struggled to pick a colour. I went with navy in the end, but they've got all kinds of pastel colours. Um, there's a couple of different types of rucksack. I went for the camera specialised one with all the sections on it, and there's a good section on the bottom here. I'll quickly show you, then we'll move on. Um, here you can put your tripod underneath and just have it hanging underneath not affecting you really like that really like that big thumbs up um so yeah, if you're interested the link to that is in the description could you cold and gray here so i am going to stick and enjoy the walk with you thanks for joining us we've got 455 in okay we'll uh, keep uh, moving on <laughs> uh, we settle for 26 degrees then don't think they were uh, happy being filmed there very strange he uh, came up and hit the camera with his hair <laughs> that was weird he was following me along but like with his hair held up so like i couldn't i don't know more attention to them then odd very odd there you go We've got the people playing. I always get tempted to say kaplunk. It's not kaplunk, is it? It's not kaplunk. It's something similar. It's, um, I'm I always sure get it. I'm these concepts thinking, do not get it right for once? I know, I always say it. I always say bowls, and it's not bowls, is it? No. It's something we get with a K, isn't it? Or something similar to kaplunk. Patank. There you go. That's a one. patank, kaplunk. That's, yeah, it gets, gets round in with me. <laughs> Oh, funny. But yes, it is glorious out here today. We've got a few hours free from work this afternoon. We're back to airport runs a little bit later. So we thought, why not? I was trying to work out what area to go for. And I thought, let's just do every area. <laughs> let's just go for it. Um, the bag fits Laura perfectly. It's my bag as well. It's already been commandeered. It's my rucksack. <laughs> So it's just perfect for this walk and um, shoving all the stuff in because we will run low on battery later and we've got aquariuses to keep us going yeah. and then we'll have a proper break at um proper bake bake break when we get to beer garden tenerife as well we're gonna have a bite to eat there uh, i've just logged on link for the rucksack it's in the description um it's an uh, american company just them big company um, I've seen them working with quite a few others. Uh, but the, yeah, the link's in the description. It's already got the Night Strider included, so it should automatically knock off the 10%. But came all the way from America. And then when we finally go back, back on holiday, it'll go all the way back. Yeah, it'll go, it'll go all the way back on, well, wherever we go on holiday, I'll be taking it. It's just perfect for GoPros and my drone will be sectioned off. You can move the sections in the back pocket here to fit whatever you want. Um, yeah that's the best bit i can't wait to show you that but it's got straps that run down the back so you can slide it onto your hand luggage so when you're pulling your hand luggage along the rucksack just sits on it uh, got to go shortly hi aj have a great afternoon thanks very much uh, did they have their meeting i think they're still doing it i've not heard anything at the moment uh, they're still 
uh, on there. Looks absolutely beautiful and vibrant. There it is. Stunning today. Stunning. Laura's just on a call. Seat Ibiza. We have a Seat Ibiza. 60 for the day. And that'll be 60 euros for the day. Uh, love your walks, lovely and warm. Thank you very much. Hope you're enjoying it. I'll just wait for Laura to catch up. She's uh, back there on the phone. Hi, are you okay? You okay? Good, thank you. You? Uh, please see my message. Sorry, I am missing a few comments here. Letting Laura catch up. Uh, can you give a shout out to Hazel and Evelyn uh, getting packed for Florida? Oh, I have a fantastic time. I'm very jealous. Very jealous indeed. Getting burnt at the Irish Rovers. It is gorgeous today. If you're out here, enjoy it. Look how busy all this is, though. Every single bar and restaurant full again people enjoying beers food so a lot of people do know i'm going to give it another quick clue here just will give you a good idea as what is to come i think it's absolutely amazing that spot that's it for now i'm not going to show too much we've got to wait a few more uh, the backpack for anyone interested thanks very much for that paul scarf he's put the link there if anyone is interested in the backpack um, we are working with them so you do get a 10% discount on that but I would never put anything on the channel that I don't agree with or enjoy or like myself I am absolutely honestly made up with that and it's gonna be perfect for when we go away my Oakley rucksack was good but for segments for you know the drone and stuff now and the GoPro when I do go away that is far better it's far more protective Ooh, the beach looks busy from here Beach looks nice and busy. Do you use a step count? I don't normally. I should do really. We should count how many steps we do. There'll be a lot. Where's the best place for large? Let you let you grande. Many of them are good. There's uh, quite a few spots. Hi, yeah, you okay? Having a good day? All right, thank you very much. You both look nice and tan there. It is nice and warm today. Yeah, I remember. Oh, you've just been to Beer Garden? Oh, you had just been, yeah. We're on the way there now. We're going to stop for a little lunch. <laughs> nice and strong for you. Yeah, yeah, no problem. No problem. Pass that to Laura. I'm back, guys. So I was on a phone call, so I'm back now. Let the uh, guys take a nice picture. So the iPhone will track the step. We'll see. I'm guessing 10,000. Have a great day. Thank you. How long have you got left? Uh, well, it's a gorgeous day for your last day, though. Enjoy. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Thank you. Okay, we're back on the move. Lovely couple there. And the beach is full, as you say, Laura. It is. This is all holiday makeup as well, isn't it? Yeah, the middle of the... Well, what are we, Thursday? This isn't really going to be residence. residence. This is all going to be... Beds, no, residence mostly as well. Bring their own or stay on the sand. Yeah. Uh, we've got 526 tuned in so far. Thanks for joining us, if you can. If you do me a big favour, hit the thumbs up button. I would really appreciate it. If you are new here as well, a uh, big welcome. Make sure you subscribe. If you want to comment or join the chat, you do have to be subscribed to do that, which is free. Yeah, it's nice and vibrant down here. We'll see what it's like when we get to Adeki. A few people are saying Adeki is a bit quieter now. Um, I did a couple of, del couple of deliveries in the GF Gran uh, Hotel and that was seemed pretty quiet compared to a few months ago. Yeah. Does seem a little bit quieter in Adeki at the moment. I think the type of clientele as well has changed just through the years, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah, I think now all the families have gone from a week or so ago. Yeah. It's gone a little bit quieter in there. And 
and then we get a lot of the Scandies, Germans and everything in the winter, don't we? Yep. Yep. More couples. I uh, have to go back to the reception desk now. Uh, thanks very much. You'll have to catch the rest on catch up. Thanks for uh, for joining us. Do you like this new little spot with the shade sitting on the beach? Nice view, that. Uh, just on lunch, sat in the car between jobs. Great to catch some live. Hope Laura's feeling better. Thanks very much, Emma. I am. Pretty much back to normal now, aren't you? Yeah. Yep, got over it. Got over pretty quickly, to be fair. Thought it's going to be a lot more long winded. Do you know if the Tiso shop is still there? I think it might be, but I'm not 100% sure. Might, I would be inclined to say yes, but I'm not 100%. Well, we've got some other live music going on here. I'll quickly show you a bit of this. Little band. Yeah, little band. Creating a bit of a vibe down here. Got a little bit of a market set. Is that setting up or finishing, Laura? I think it's setting up, isn't it, down here? Yeah. Don't know what he said. No. <laughs> I think we've got them. Um, it might be a bit of a market on this evening. I think they're setting up here. Can you wish happy birthday to Freya and Etty? Visited a deck in August. Um, to your great news advice videos. Hi, are you okay? Having a good time? Good. Nice. Here till Sunday? Nice. How long have you been here for? A week or? Yeah. Nice. Where are you off to now then? Okay, similar to us then. We're walking all the way as well, yeah. You're doing the same walk. <laughs> Very nice. Have a great day. Thank you. Okay. Nice to see you. Uh, they're doing the same walk as us all the way to Fanya Bay. It's got to be one of the most popular walks ever, this. Packing away. Ah, they're packing away. Oh, oh we missed it. Eating. Missed it, likes flowers and stuff there. We missed it, unfortunately. Arriving tomorrow, hope to see you both. If you do, make sure you come and say hello. Uh, what's happened to Harriet's tea room? Uh, it's open in Lost Chris, but the one in Fanny Bay is gone. Uh, how is Laura? All good, all good. Beautiful day there and very busy. It sure is, sure is. That breeze is welcome, Disney. It is a nice breeze. It's cooling everything down. Let's see what it says here. 24, it says on here. It said 27 in a decky earlier. It does say 24 on this one. It is nice, it's a gorgeous day, gorgeous. What do you think about the Apart Hotel K in Columbus? It's in a good spot, it's not far from everything. Uh, a few people say it does get a little bit noisy, but overall, good hotel, it's popular. Hope to see you in May, staying at Solorona. It's not far from us. Watching this video makes me want to do a week on my own in, in April. Go for it, go for it. Get it booked while it's cheap. Please wish, wish my wife, Joanne, a happy birthday for tomorrow and a happy 25th wedding anniversary for Saturday. Have a great uh, day, guys. I'm sure uh, Andrew will have uh, spoiled you for both. <laughs> I think I might be ready for a drink stop soon. <laughs> it's uh, hotter than I thought. Yeah, the office is nice and cool. But uh, up here, hot. Tunnel bar not quite open yet. 
think that opens later on. Definitely feeling a little coffee stop coming up. <laughs> Definitely feeling it coming up. <laughs> the guy gave him money. He didn't even look up from his phone or thank him or anything. <laughs> Just kept his head down in his phone. Let's see how busy this beach is. A lot busier. See, again, basically full. I don't think you're going to get any sunbeds. What a gorgeous day. Gorgeous day, that is. Uh, how was Lisa doing? Um, okay. Still feels a bit, you know, not the best. She lost her voice and everything, so... Still a little while before she'll be back in work, but uh, not bad. Hi. Oh, hi, are you okay? Very. It's, uh, it's nice. Big long walk all the way to Adaki now. Wow. Yeah. Nice. You're just chilling on here, are you? Just chilling, yeah. 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 Right. Much busier compared to then. Big difference. Yeah. Nice. What time did you get onto the beach? 11 ish, and there were still beds then? Yeah. Not so much now, though. Yeah. Lovely to see you. Thanks for saying hello. Great to meet you. Oh, lovely lady there came over and said hello. The sand was piping hot. She was dancing on the sand. It's uh, very, very nice and very warm today. Oh, the water looks gorgeous. Let's just go for a little paddle. It does look nice, that water. Good day for a boat trip. Jet skis, ocean carts. Uh, can you give a shout out please to Ellie home from university living the life hi Ellie how's it going I hope you're well oh, people are saying I don't want to be seen. is there <laughs> a lot of ducking and diving going on busy up in the breeze in we couldn't get in there the other day it was full very popular Are the trees on the beach new? Uh, fairly new. They've been, they put them in sort of during, lockdown. I think during lockdown, yeah. So they've been in for about a year or so now. I quite like them. I, I'd like them to put more in. I think they look really nice. And they do provide a little bit of shade. People sort of sit, in, sit under them for a bit of shade. They are nice. Uh, my su husband says, did you enjoy the match Monday night? I certainly didn't. <laughs> certainly not. But it was expected. Look how blue that water is, I know. Laura. I know. It's gorgeous. You can see it all the way back there. That is stunning. Hi, guys. Sorry I'm late. Hope to see you at the end of April. I hope so. How old are, do you have to be to do the ocean carting? Um, I think she said it was 10. 10 years old as long as it's quite flat if it's a little bit choppy you do have to be a little bit older because you've got to sort of be able to control it a bit more if it's nice and flat uh, you can be your kids can give it a go starbucks sandwich and frappuccino ordered in for the long haul very nice paul thanks for joining us got a long way to go yet we're going to be walking all the way uh, to uh, Del Duque from here. Stop now and get drunk. I don't think that would be a good idea. I don't think anyone would be getting their cars later on. <laughs> we'll stop somewhere for a drink in a minute though. It is getting hot. We do walk at a quick pace. Does the water fountain in the sea still work? Doesn't, not anymore. It used to. Used to be really nice that, but not anymore, unfortunately. It stopped working just before I came out here on holiday, didn't it? Yeah, because I was sort of bigging it up to you, saying how nice it would be. And then yeah. we got here and it uh, wasn't working.
Uh, we're coming out next week. Hope to see you guys. Hope Sun King still do one euro pints. They do one euro three quarter pints because they're not a proper pint, remember? <laughs> I think they do, yeah. It's uh, one euro for like, a, they call it a large beer, which is like three quarters of a pint. We're going past there in a second, so I think we'll be able to see the one euro pint sign anyway. Where are you now? We're currently above uh, Las Vistas Beach is where we are now, so we're heading into Las Americas now. Boy, it's hot. I'm going to put some sun cream on. I will need to put more on in a bit. Uh, Mick Garvey is on. Afternoon, all you people who are working remotely. <laughs> Check it hasn't fallen behind the settee. <laughs> oh, funny. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of uh, spare beds in this bit. I noticed the flags are yellow on this section as well. Might be a little bit windier on this bit. Staying at the El Mirador Grand in June. It's all of a sudden got dead quiet. <laughs> it's uh, it's gone all quiet in this section. Yeah, it was nice and uh, quiet in this bit. Where are you thinking for a coffee? I think maybe we'd try and push it and try and get one in Metropolis, maybe. Try and get round to that area before we stop. Got a long way to go. Uh, can you ask Laura if she is has any plans to move back to the UK? <laughs> if you didn't see it on her Instagram, she would post a funny like TikTok reel on Instagram before. Uh, make sure you go and follow her, it was funny that. <laughs> yeah, it is uh, funny, we were watching that show uh, last night. Hi, are you okay? Good to see you, yeah. Having a good time? Yeah, yeah. Anyway, thanks for all the updates and the masks are being finished. I hope so, they're having the meeting today, but I don't know any news on it yet. We'll see. Yeah. I can't believe you're letting Laura carry the pack though. Uh, it's, not, it's not too heavy. Oh. I'll, have, I'll have a turn. I'll swap. Yeah. Where are you off to? We're just going to drop for some tapas. Okay. Yeah. We've been coming here for the last 23 years. Right. This time of year. Nice. Love it. Love it so yeah. much. It's so, it's so good to be Where's your best fish and chip shop? I don't do fish and chips, so I don't. No. What my, my dad's favourite is the fox in Los oh, Cristianos. Um. Hard to explain, isn't it? Yeah. Near Christian Sir. They've done all the pies and English people have run a fish and chip shop and done all the pies. That wouldn't have been me. Yeah, that's not me. No. I'm not I don't do the I don't do fish, so I'm not. But I, from what I know, my dad's favourites are either chill out or the fox. Yeah. No, you're further, yeah, you're further in, you're more Christian, say, yeah, yeah, yeah. You too. Thank you very much. I know I've got a long way to go. Lovely to see you. Thank you. Ah, nice couple there. Um, I wish I was there. It looks lovely. Just looking forward to Florida. Yeah, have a fantastic time. Very jealous of that. Oh, yeah, I've got even more dancers here. wonder if they'll jump away from the camera as well. <laughs> there you go, Frosty Pint, one euro. There's the sign there. And it is rammed in there as well. Jeez. And I've got to talk over this music so I don't get a strike as well. <laughs> it's busy in there, isn't it? Not a single spare table or chairs. Raymond is the same. Raymond 3. We're going to stay along the beachfront, I think. We'll find somewhere for coffee with a nice view. Yeah, we've done the Golden Mile recently. We'll stay on the beachfront. Uh, can't wait for four weeks' time. Oh, you can't be too nice to count down for your holiday, can you? Well, that really, it doesn't help as well because the airlines start emailing you every two minutes, something. Yeah. This many days to go. 
Loads of people do those we countdowns. Have got your extra seats, i.e. give us some more money. <laughs> Loads of them do do like a nice little holiday countdown as well. I think you can log in and go on the apps and stuff. Yeah. Uh, what is your favourite Disney resort? We haven't really stayed in any, have we? Favourite wise like though. To go to the Polynesian, don't we? Yeah, we like the Polynesians, nice. And I always like the look of the uh, contemporary as well. Yeah. I can smell the ocean, the sand, and also. Uh, sun cream. Oh, sun cream, that's the smell of holidays. Yeah, I'm getting the sun cream smells. Which uh, really makes you feel like you're on holiday then. Uh, can you say hi to my girlfriend, Jane? Hi, Jane. Let's have a little look at this view going back across. Temperature right now, it's uh, said before, Jack 24. 24, 25 at the moment, nice breeze. I know, it's, I'm telling you, smelly vision will be invented though, I'm telling you, will be invented. Sound of the waves and the sound of kids playing as well, that's another sign that you're on the beach, isn't it? Screaming kids. <laughs> yeah. Kids' favourite place to be on the beach, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, has Laura been asked to do any selfies? Yeah, plenty of times. We normally get pictures together if we can. If we're on a live stream though, someone has to hold the camera so it's not quite as easy. Yeah, I'm just sort of in the back out for the most part. I get the odd picture. Yeah, Laura's happy to as well if you want one, no problem. I uh, got lovely weather in London and your self on my TV, vitamin D overload. It is gorgeous. I mean, if we'd have a coffee in there if you could get a table, but they're all full. I think this is going to be the theme of the day. It's uh, all very busy. Okay, we'll keep on walking. We're going to try and stop for a coffee somewhere along the way shortly. Maybe the Metropolis, but I reckon the Metropolis is going to be rammed. Mainly because there's a few waves today and a bit of wind. So it will be uh, great for the surfers. They'll be all be out in force. They've got Mum Strider on there. Hi Mum, how's it going? Wish I was walking with you. Can't stride that fast. Yeah, we are walking a little bit quicker. Hi, are you okay? I know, you said before. Come in Canaria, see me. <laughs> Thank you. He says the same every time. <laughs> yeah, he's Denzel Washington. Oh, cute dog. He must be boiling. Cute. Very cute. I tell you what, it's busier than I thought it was going to be. If you are enjoying the stream, please do hit the thumbs up. Even if you're watching on Catch Up, it really does help. And if you are new, make sure you subscribe. Sorry, Laura's just doing another call. Got her busy working. Best place to get a deal on a game of golf. Don't want to pay 100 around. There's no way. No way you're going to avoid it, unfortunately. It's 105 euros around in most places. Um, there's no way of getting it cheaper, especially if you're not a resident. If you're a resident, you can get resident discounts, but other than that, you're gonna struggle. I mean, the courses are fully booked at that price, so you're gonna really struggle to get it any cheaper. Um, it's, uh, 
all very busy and very full at the moment, even with those high prices. Love this beach. Looks a little bit more tropical, this one. You've got a lovely view of Lagomera today as well, which is dead clear. No deals for golf at the moment. The deals for golf do kick in on the uh, 30th of April. They, they do start to get discounted. Uh, Laura's trying to tell us someone how to uh, return the car. I think they want to return it early. Uh, where can we find the man who paints the dog portraits? We walked past him before. He's in Los Cristianos, uh, right opposite the beach. He's right on the beachfront outside the sweet shop. Um, he's really good, really good. Uh, do you have much uh, availability for automatics in May? We've got a couple more automatics on the way. Um, but some of them have already been taken. As soon as you know the date, send me them. The automatics always go first. We've had a few reservations already for May. I've got two on the way, but I think even some of them have already got reservations in as well. I do like that view. I wonder if they, I don't know whether they do coffee though. I don't think they do. There's a table there, but there's no coffee, no shade as well. I'll be frazzled. Yeah, <laughs> I'll be frazzled. We are heading for, we're definitely going to have something to eat in Beer Garden, but if we can have a little stop first along the way, we will do. Somewhere nice. Any chance of a quick look at the Med Palace? I have done it on the last two live streams. There isn't too much really going on. We've seen people in the rooms cleaning some of the rooms higher up, but other than that, really not much movement. I'll show you a quick look. It looks like maybe they've been they've been painting. Not really much gone on with the pool deck. It's a nice pool deck, isn't it? Massive. So we'll just have to wait and see. It's meant to be opening in April, but it looks a long way away. But maybe they'll spin it round quite quickly. So it looks a little bit of a way off. They've been painting, but it's nothing to do with the hotel. They've been painting this here. That's why I wonder about the paint. So yeah, they're cleaning some of the rooms, but... It still looks a way off to me. But you never know, could do a miraculous opening. Yeah, indeed. Courses are very busy, even at these prices, yeah. Uh, my dad's coming over in a few weeks to play and uh, they're gonna have to pay the full, the full back. I get resident discount, which still isn't even that much, really. Um, but yeah, it's... Uh, always expensive in the winter until you get to the end of april the prices drop down to about 65 euros around hi are you okay thumbs up everyone loving the live yeah if you are enjoying it please do hit that thumbs up button yeah i think it's going to be safe as paradise further round we won't be getting a coffee for hours <laughs> i have got aquarius in the bag i'll have a mouthful of that in a minute Yeah, some big waves there. Yeah. Some days are just, you just gotta get out and do a live stream because the weather is stunning today. It's meant to be a little bit mixed on Sunday, but today and tomorrow are meant to be fantastic. Tomorrow is meant to be the best day of the week, Ooh. is what they've said on the radio. Hi, I know it's not a proper site, but at the moment, especially on Facebook advertising accommodation. Yeah, just be careful if you are making reservations for accommodation. There is a few accommodation scams that go on. Again, happens everywhere, not just Tenerife, but do be careful if you're booking, you know, some of these apartments and things and you're paying in full by bank transfer, etc. Just be careful. Um, it happens everywhere and people will arrive and then there's, there's no accommodation or... The accommodation's there, but it was a scam and they've paid someone else and not the actual renter. Coming out on my own on the 29th of March for a few days, hope to see you. If you do, Harry, make sure you come and say hello. Have a fantastic time. People ask me, oh, is it a nice place to go on your own? Yeah. And I'd say, yeah, it's very friendly. You can have some lovely long walks. You can go and play golf. You can chill on the beach. I don't find any problems eating on my own. The restaurants are all very accommodating. And if you go to a nice bar, the bar 
bar sat in nice too and you'll speak to you and you'll get to know the bar staff and you'll go back to the same bar. Yeah, the bar staff, you, you know, you'll make friends with people and stuff. It's, uh, I would 100% recommend coming on your own. And if you can, if you can, leave your missus at home. Just come on your own. If you can. <laughs> you would die. You could not handle a week without me. <laughs> I'd be all right. I'd be all right, don't worry. <laughs> uh, any chance of cleaning my golf clubs, please? If I could get in the apartment, maybe. I'll ask Laura. Do the restaurants still take cards? They'll take both. At the moment, they take both. Cash card is no problem at all. It's another nice spot for a drink. We'll quickly have a look at this pool. We'll make you all want to have a swim. I'm going to quickly show you this. Again, there's no seats in there at all. Nothing. Nil point. Let me just quickly show you this pool. If this doesn't make you want to have a swim, I don't know what will. I think it's the only place I would feel comfortable on my own. It is, you'll be absolutely fine. Look at that. If that doesn't make you want to have a dip in there, that is stunning. Why is it cheaper in May and April? I've done a whole video on that, so that is going out, I think, tonight or tomorrow. I've done a whole video on all the golf information. So it's coming up on the channel. It'll explain why it goes cheaper, uh, best time to play, etc. It's coming up on the channel either tonight or tomorrow, that one. You're such a tease. Oh, yeah, he's back on his lower back there. Ouch. <laughs> Right, we'll quickly show you these where you just want to have a drink. Even the gardens have got like lemon trees in. Stunning. Okay. What do you think is the best boat excursion in August? I've got to say Muscat. Love it. We had a few people on there yesterday. Uh, and everyone who's been on it so far from my video has absolutely loved it. It's a fantastic trip, that is. Okay, I'm going to plonk you down with a bit of a view for a minute. I'm going to have some of my uh, Aquarius, I think. Oh. This has got to be one of the best drinks. If you've not tried this, make sure you do. So cool, so refreshing. Oh, it's nice. Good, isn't it? How much for a, you will pay more in a restaurant? It's normally about 250, 3 euros in a restaurant. Some of them are 350. Leave me sat there with a drink here. Yeah, you'd enjoy it today, Mum. It is uh, boiling hot with a nice breeze. See how clear the water is. Assistant Laura doing a good job. <laughs> Do you want me to carry it for a bit? Yeah, okay. You have to loosen the straps a bit for me. Are we best bringing cash? I'd bring a little bit of both. A little bit of both. Just in case your card doesn't work or something. Or some, it's very rare, but some bars or cafes, only some of them don't accept cards. So I'd just bring a little bit of both, just so you've got it. Okay, thank you very much. Oh, that's nice and comfy. Yeah, nice. It's more padded than my Oakley one. It's really padded. Yeah, I look like a proper explorer now, don't I? Yeah, you do, I feel me. No, no, it's it. Yeah? Yeah. There we go. So we're going to carry on walking now through Las Americas. We're aiming for San Eugenio first for a little lunch break. And then we'll be... Uh, Carrying on all the way to Del Duque. Let's hope we get some signal in Fania Bay today. We'll see. <laughs> Let me flip this back around. Laura the Explorer. Hi, are you okay? Yeah. Having a good time? Yeah. Enjoy. Thank you. Have a good day. Well, look at these, aren't these cool? The little birds made of, um, they're made of bamboo, aren't they? Oh, no, they're made of the leaves, remember? Yeah, the bamboo leaves. 
really good. Need a hat, Laura? They're really good. We got 641 tuned in with us live. Thank you so much. It's busier than I thought it was going to be. I know we're busy, but this is getting a little bit busier than I thought it was going to be. Was the weather a bit mixed yesterday? I think it was, though, wasn't it? I think everyone's out now. It's sunny. Oh, you're walking 500 miles, just a bit. <laughs> Got a long way to go. Had to go off the live stream, don't know if you answered. Is it busy November, December? Um, November is normally a busy month, and then the first two weeks of December, historically, is quieter. However, this year, I don't think you can, you can count on anything. This year is all revenge travel, people coming when they normally wouldn't, people rescheduling for times they wouldn't normally, so. Yeah. So I think you can't go too much off previous years because I think this year is a little bit different. But it is getting up to the after two year anniversary of when the world shut down. Jeez, two years since everything shut down. It feels... Since, no, since normal. It doesn't feel like two years ago. I know. Two years since everyone's world got flipped upside down. Some people made a mint and some people lost everything. Some people just chilled out, like my mum. <laughs> uh, love this stretch coming up. This is the popular stretch, this little bit. So you can even see the, the very tops of the cliffs of Gigantes yeah. from here today. And some huge waves. Wow, they are big. Seems to be more cloud now. Yes, there is a little bit of cloud inland. Uh, but down here on the front should stay sunny. Hi, are you okay? Ah, we're cool. <laughs> back up with the, the, the couple we met in Los Cristiano, so we're doing the same walk. We're still on the same track. We're going the right way then, Laura. We know we're going the right way. <laughs> we're going the right way. <laughs> we'll try and stop for a coffee in a minute. Uh, exit the live chat and hit the thumbs up if you can, be much appreciated. Support these two explorers taking us on their journey. <laughs> do you feel like a, I feel, to be fair, I feel better with the bag with some drinks in. So that if these are too busy, you're not stressing looking for a drink. And uh, having the battery pack as well, I'm not worried about the phone dying a battery either. Yes, because my backpack's on, not that big now we've got sun cream in this as well, so when we stop for a coffee, I'll be reloading with a bit of sun cream. I'm made up with it, absolutely made up with it. How much travel with this? See how easy it makes it. <laughs> Thanks very much. We've got to keep walking, but I, I appreciate the offer. You having a good time? Thank you very much. You've got a great spot there. Thank you very much. Have a good time. Oh, lovely guy up there. If you're watching, thanks very much. That I think he offered, day, he offered us up for a drink, but we've got to try and keep on walking. So I've got about three hours max for this, but I really do appreciate it. Thank you very much. I uh, hope you're having a good time there. The views he's got from that balcony, nice, very nice. Beach club as well there, it's quite nice. So you can't, that's the only open of an evening, the little place we went to. You'd have to go in the main club of a daytime, I think. Which amazes me, if that was open for coffees now, I'd be straight in, that would be busy for coffees, that, surely. Yeah, but down there, it's not full, it's not gonna open a second one, are they? No. Uh, can you get to Hemingway's on this walk? You've got to cut inland. It's a little bit more inland, Hemingway's. Uh, it's the other side of the motorway. Wow, there's some big waves. Can't be too big. <laughs> I think they are, because I can't see many surfers. A couple of surfers, I think brave ones. They are big. Oh, yeah. Got 
they're like 14 foot waves. They are pretty big. They keep missing them as well. The big waves are there and they keep going over them. See if they actually catch one at some point. Maybe they're trying to go over them. Maybe they're just not picking up. Oh yeah. They're trying. It keeps missing it, yeah. Yeah. yeah they, are. they are very big waves today. Massive. Very big. They are crashing over the wall there as well. Ah, there you go. He's caught one there, but he didn't last very long. Big Very big. See if we can get a coffee. All you can hear is the sound of the waves. It's literally all you can hear. Love seeing you do this walk. Tried it in set, but gave up halfway through. It is a long walk. If you're planning on doing the same, uh, it is very long. Me and Laura do walk very quickly, uh, but it's doable. It'll just take plenty of stops along the way. Uh, make sure you stay hydrated, but it is a very popular walk, this. We're gonna be going all the way over there, right round the coast. When you look at it like that, it puts me off. <laughs> but we're gonna do it. This is where you just have a, a perfect table waiting for you in the in the shade in Metropolis. You never know your luck. Have we seen any tables anywhere? Hey, it's inside though with the music. Hmm. Okay, it looks like Laura might have found a table. Looks like we might be going in, everyone. We might have actually finally got a table in Metropolis. Let's see. Laura's straight in there. She's in like Flint. Let's get that one, Laura. Or that one. No, sorry, right. stick with that one. Stick with that one. There's actually two in the end. Look after the bag. Oh boy, boy oh boy, that is hot, that is hot. It's warm out here today. We're finally in, I mean we haven't got the, you know, the prime spot, but we're in. Nice coffee now, it'll sort me out before we stop at, uh, stop for a little bite to eat in the uh, beer garden. You having a shandy? Oh, I'm having a nice shandy. That's got to be coffee for me. I've got the coffee headache. I need a coffee. <laughs> I'm well and truly hooked. Fabulous sound of the waves. If you are enjoying the stream, guys, thank you very much. Please do hit the thumbs up. Uh, it's a long walk today, but it just covers all the areas. A lot of people will skip through to the area they want to see. It just covers everything. Hello. Could I get a Lecce Lecce Grande? Yes. Muy caliente? Yes. Very hot? And a... Yeah, that's okay. No problem. Thank you. Oh. Laura is looking very tanned, apparently. That's, uh, that's what Mum says. I've got a different makeup on today than I normally wear as well, again. <laughs> yeah, you look a bit tanned, yeah? Uh, sky behind you, it's uh, hot but sunny today. Uh, we have done it lots of times and we're in our 60s, yep, take plenty of fluid. Uh, if you do plan on doing this walk, it is nice. It's a nice thing to do. Yeah. About here, then your mum and dad get yeah. a bit tired. It's tough, it's a tough walk. I find it going this way from Lost Chris to Adeki slightly more inclined as well. I found it a little bit easier coming the other way last time. Yeah. So, coffee time now. 
Coffee time. Give me the boost that I need. So, what I'm going to ask you now, we've got 656 tuned in at the moment, thank you very much. Hit the thumbs up button, subscribe if you're new. What, what vlog would you like to see that we've never done before? We're going to have never done it before, it's got to be a brand new vlog that we've never done. What would you like us to do or try and film this week or next week? Let's see. You need to get my other vlog out. Some people are saying they can see you in my sunglasses. <laughs> I know, I need to get Laura's little trip home to the weekend out. I've got the golf vlog going out. So I think tonight I'll get that out for you. Uh, any golfers out there. Um, I've got a few things already filmed, but I'm looking for some new ideas. See, see what people can come up with. We are just going to be taking a little bit of a break here for 10 or 15 minutes and then we'll be moving on. I'd like budget restaurants. We've done a few of them. They were, they were quite good. Oh, yeah. Hire a little boat. I've done that before, though. Yeah. Done that before. Um, apartments for sale. Could try. Um, Laura Park's not really our cup of tea, Mandy. We wouldn't, we wouldn't really be going there. Um, Club Mystique. Uh, vlog for St. Patrick's Day celebrations. I think we will be doing that. We're going out with Laura's mum and dad, aren't we? Yeah, we just need to find somewhere not to do something for the day. Where, where was that that you said? Oh, um, Kellers? Kellers? Kelly, Kellers? Kellers? What's it called? Kinsellas, that was it. Uh, Castle San Miguel, Crazy Golf, who would win? It'd definitely be me, uh, Amy. Yeah. Flamingo Beach, see I can't film specific accommodations though without permission, that's the other tricky thing. I'd love to go and film them all for you. Um, but in terms of filming, you know, hotels and things, you have to, you know, be invited. Some of the shortcuts to places, okay. Uh, where did I take Laura? I took Laura uh, home to the sofa and we had a lovely leftover tandoori hut. It was what we had for tea last night. Yeah. Nice. We just chilled, we watched a bit of Netflix. Um, we visit the Finky one on the boom tracks, maybe. What I might try and do. The thing is, to be fair, the boom tracks are mad, bit mad busy and he's only got three trikes. So. I'd love to go and do the wine tasting one, um, but you know, there's other he's got loads of other clients booked in, so maybe when it goes quieter for them, and he gets you know a, a day or so free, we'll go, we'll go and do the wine tasting tour. I think on the boom tracks, it's the only one we haven't done. Um, vlog for the best gel gelato stalls. Would be a good one. Well, we already know where the best one is. It's in Las Gaitas. Valentino's. A whole day eating ice creams. <laughs> right, some good ideas. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. Um, bags are packed, Bill. Very nice. Yeah, it was just chilled last night. We'd already been out a few times this week, haven't we? So it was, it was a bit chilled. Hire a supercar for a day. Cost a fortune. <laughs> uh, Mum says pyramid to Greenmore. Could do. Quieter areas, Golf del Sir to San Blas. It is a little bit quiet around there. Did, did, delivered, a, delivered a car in San Blas, I think three, four days ago to some subscribers if you're watching. Um, it was quiet around there. It was. Uh, day in the life with your friends who also live in Tenerife. We keep ourselves to ourselves, really, to be honest. Too busy as well. It's mad busy with work at the moment. It's mental, absolutely mental. I've been a vlog on Monday, but I've had to work all week. Yeah, I've been working this week in particular with, with Lisa being off sick. It's, it's been tricky. Um, loving the sunglasses, thank you very much. Here come our coffees. Oh, nice. Thank you. There we go, let me show you these coffees. Very nice. This'll this will sort me out now and give me the energy to get us up to San Eugenio is the next stop. And we're gonna be eating as well, something to eat. You can help me pick what I'm gonna to have to eat as well. 
You like the cheesy chips last time, didn't you? Um, could you not go to hell? We do. We ask all the time. We email all the time. Have various hotels to film. They, they just don't get it. They think a lot of them think you want free night stay. They're just not really interested. I don't think they get it. I don't think they understand it because GF Graham has had thousands from our videos. I think some of them just don't understand the vlogging thing. And love to film them, but. North Tenerife, again, I mean, it's on the list. It's getting up there. Like, we've got a little three hour gap now. We've come out and we're going to fill it with this live stream. If we were to go the north now with the three hour gap that we've got, we'd only have an hour in the north and we'd have to be driving back. Yeah, that's not a very good vlog, is it? No, it's, we need a bit more time for that. Um, love to see you and Laura go do the buggies. It was so funny before, we could do. Buggies up in the mountains. Quad biking. Can you get our sunglasses on subscription? You can get prescription ones only, of these. There's only one website that sells them, and I wanted to pay for myself, and you're 500 quid. One, only one website is 500 euros. allowed to do the prescription. Only one. Only one company that can make the uh, Oakley Prism lenses uh, subscription. One company be allowed to do it. Reaction vlog with you and Laura at the next door, we could do. <laughs> I mean, it won't be very good vlog, I'm wait. just sitting there with a face on and I'm just like cheering because we're winning. Um, one of the clever things to be a book one night in a hotel, you want to vlog. Yeah, but it's very expensive though. That would be expensive at the moment. It's expensive to stay in these hotels that a lot of people want filming five star. What, what would one night be in the GF Grand? Hotels, Looking 200 odd quid, 250 quid, and as Laura said, a lot of them are only doing minimum stay two nights. If they were cheap enough, yeah, but I haven't got that much money to spend on filming them. We'll see, we'll keep working on it, we'll keep working on, working on a lot of things in the background, don't worry. Higher push bikes for the day, it's an idea. Keep the ideas coming, this coffee's going down very nicely. Mm. That was good. Yeah, done. Was spot on that. We're gonna keep walking now. Pay the bill. See, finger out, no cash. I've not been paid for the yeah, we could do that as well, Mum. Could do. Cycle down Tady. Oh, yeah. What is it? 500 miles and 500 miles. Yeah. Uh, you doing any back from the video views? No, not that much. You really don't. You really don't. Not that much. Uh, bear in mind, YouTube takes 30% of anything you earn, then the tax man takes another 20%. You would not earn, you're not going to earn 250 quid from one hotel video. No way. Um, not unless you're hitting. Maybe 100,000 views. Yeah. That sort of ballpark. You'd have to get a lot of views to cover that. And food shopping, then Laura can cook it. Again, I'm going to do that this week. Go-kart, see, we've done the go-kart. Uh, fuel prices have gone up. It's about one, 130 a litre at the moment, roughly. 130-ish a litre. Can you ask them for the bill when you go in, please? Staying at Sol Tenerife. Yes, I know Sol Tenerife. Um, it's in a good spot, that. In a good spot to film a proposal. Sorry, I'm just looking across. It's, uh, seems to be getting busier now. There's people waiting for tables now. Horse riding. Laura's done that, but we could do again. Have you ever done a video on budget accommodation? Um, yeah, families might find it useful. I'd love to. If I can get invited into some of them, I'd love to show the rooms and the prices. Um, I'll do anything, I'll do any of them. Ever done any surfing? No, I haven't done that. That coffee was quick, it was. It was nice. Spot on. 
some tremors occurring recently. There is. Could we have the build, please? Yes. Um, yeah, there has been a few little earthquakes. I've not felt any, but I have seen them in the news, yeah. Um, only one video, one winner on that video. Have the food prices gone up at the moment? No. A few little things in the supermarket have cracked up. But... It's uh, YouTube Live. The lady said hello, I don't know if you heard. Let's <laughs> see. Thank you. Get some change. We've got 696 tuned in. We are going to uh, continue to uh, walk now. Next stop is San Eugenio for a bite to eat. And we're going to be carrying on all the way to Adeki. So it's going to be a long one. going to be a live one. How about a Facebook Live on Paddy's Day? We could do. There's going to be some live music going on. All those viewers can invite you to our hotels to spend some time. I could do my best. I could do. I wouldn't want to invade on anyone's room or holiday like that. Though, look at that view behind. Gorgeous. You could be in Miami with a view like that. Uh, afternoon tea somewhere. Yeah, that's quite a few ideas coming in. That's good. That's good. Hi from Skegness. Hi Sparkles. Hope you're well. Hope you're well. Next Florida vlog will be some point. Maybe. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe Saturday. Some point. Do a vlog if you are, I'd struggle with that. Meat, fish and chips, I would struggle. I don't do fish. Um, I will be doing that later on this month, Tasha. We'll be taking the Fred Olsen across to Lagomera and we're gonna go and film the golf over there. Uh, my dad and his friends are coming over. We're gonna have the day over there to play some golf. That includes the ferry. So I'll, be, I'll do that as a bit of a vlog for you all. Uh, so vlogs on cheaper restaurants in Playa Las Americas, okay. The, the only reason we don't do so many of them is not because they're not good. It's just simply because a lot of them don't really have much gluten-free for Laura to eat. Um, that is the only reason we've gotten. We, we quite enjoy the 8.95 menus and all that, but a lot of the things Laura can't eat them. Um, so that's why we tend to go to other places a little bit more, um, just because they have a little bit more gluten-free options. A spin-off vlog called Laura the Explorer. <laughs> Ferry to Lagomera for the day, we're going to do that one. Hi from Aintree, hello, how's the uh, weather over there? Nice to catch you live. I've just paid. I'm, waiting for, I'm just waiting for the change. Uh, sitting in Aberdeen Steakhouse, give us a wave. I think that's just further down, I will do my best. Love to see your sister's trip up Tady. I know it's not easy to vlog that though. Um, I know, so I've got to get, there's so much to be done. Uh, vlog with Laura holding the camera and you running behind her. <laughs> Just managed to catch up for five minutes. Thank you very much for joining. If you are watching on catch up as well, I uh, appreciate it. Uh, yeah, hit the thumbs up button. We've got 710 tuned in, only 490 thumbs up. Thank you. Thank you. That's for you. Thank you very much. There we go, job done. If you're wondering, that was two euros each. So four euros for two Lecce Lecce Grandes. I'm going to keep the bag, yep. Yeah. Oh, it's on me. I'll turn it around, guys. Here we go. Andy with his backpack. Come on. I do, well, you can hold the camera for a bit if you want. Let me know. So Laura do a bit of uh, the walking and talking now. <laughs> Laura, I, I, you can do it. The only bit, again, Laura struggles with is reading the comments because of her eyesight. And do you know what? I get distracted. Like, when you don't hear me for ages on the live, it's not because I'm not interested, it's because I keep getting distracted. Yeah, just see a dog on the beach or something and yeah. that's it then. I'm done then, yeah. But I am going to eventually do some more, aren't I? Hi, are you okay? Hi. Good, thanks to you. Thank you very much. You having a good time? Really great time. Yeah. Ah, yeah, nice. Night before we went, yeah, Tandoori Hut. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Good. Where are you staying? Okay, nice. 
beautiful. Yeah. I've never been in, so I've never seen it. Yeah, good. Yeah. You were asking how do you bet was new restaurant? Yep. It's about something for seven beans. Hope so. No, it'll be 17th, 17th, hopefully. I know where it is. I showed it on the live stream. It's in Lost Chris, yeah. I'm not going to reveal too much yet. I don't want to spoil it, but. Yeah, yeah, no problem. There we go. Right, let him just take a picture. Sorry, I was just trying to read that comment then. Oh, there you go, just taking nice pictures. Uh, God, what's Andrew look like with a little backpack on? Look at him. <laughs> yeah, everyone says that. Everyone says that. How long are you here for? Two weeks. Nice. And you've just arrived recently? Yeah, uh, Tuesday. Oh, you've got plenty to go then. I just missed a Tuesday night. We literally were just... Because we travelled for, I think it was uh, 8 o'clock in the morning. Right. We get here. We were from early to get them 2 o'clock in the morning. So yeah, it's tiring, yeah. Tired, yeah. So yeah. So, back to normal now. Good. Thank you very much. Well, I'm sure you'll see us again if you're here for two weeks. You'll see us again. Plenty of live streams on the way. So. Ah, there you go. Thank you very much. I know you watch then. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, I think he's on watching. Oh yeah, Mick. I will be calling you Paul. <laughs> there you go. Lovely to meet you. Lovely both. to meet you, guys. Have Thanks a great time. See you next week again. Lovely yeah, to see you. you. Pleasure, pleasure. Thank, thank you. you. Oh, lovely couple there, from uh, all the way from Ireland. There. Very nice to meet you guys. If you're watching on catch up. Oh. Uh, let's see. Happy belated birthday, Charlie. I've missed quite a few comments there. I did try. Turn it back around. It's hard to keep up. We only see about two or three comments before they shift up on our screen. Just sat enjoying a crisp butty. Ooh. God, do you know what? I don't like crisp butties. No. Love a chip butty. I'll put any sort of potato on a butty. Mash anything, but not crisps. I don't know what it is. Okay. Never been a fan of them. See, I, I like a nice cheese and cheese and onion crisp baguette. Yeah. You like a nice cheese baguette with some cheese and onion crisp on it. Yeah. What do you think about the Rio Arecus? I think that's the Arucus, Arecus, I can't, I can never say it correctly. Um, I think that's the one in, is that the one in um, Calio, Slovakia, is it? I think it's that one. Uh, it's meant to be a lovely hotel, but I've never really been in it or done much in there to judge it, to be honest. Tell Laura, she looks fabulous. That is one, that's got Tenerife on that, but you tuck it in so you can't see. <laughs> yeah, let everyone know you're in Tenerife. <laughs> Laura always looks lovely. Thanks, Sparkles. Always trying she to make does. Yeah? Oh no, you it can't beat a, a crisp butty with brown sauce. Brown sauce should should. Oh, oh no, no. My worst nightmare: fish and chips with brown sauce. Oh no. You can't smell mayonnaise or salad cream or no. anything. Oh, brown sauce stinks. Even ketchup after five minutes to knock your sick, doesn't it? Yeah. No. Oh no. Oh, there's that shop, Alley Hop. There's not many of them around, is there? <laughs> that shop that's everywhere. So, a few more surfers in this area because the waves are a little bit uh, not quite as big. We've got paragliders out there, jet skis. I think Mum's off. Thanks very much for tuning in. I'm off for an eye test. Enjoy, Mum. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Is tourism getting better now? 100%. We are very much nearly back to normal. I mean, look at that. Back that way. Look at all the people. It is well and truly back uh, with a bang. Definitely. Very much back to normal. There, there is a big meeting going on today as to potentially li well, finding out when they will lift the mask rule indoors. I did a little news update on the channel about it yesterday. I don't know the results of that meeting. I don't know the results of it. Um, I presume we'll find out later today. Uh, we'll keep an eye on it, but hopefully we will find out when uh, mandatory masks are going to be lifted and it will become optional. I'm, I'm going to say something, yeah. 
we still have to isolate the quarantine when we've got COVID. Well, we're going to find out, but that might change as well. We would not have, exactly, they're going to take that off as well because they can't take the masks off because we know the numbers are skyrocket, which is normal. But if we're still, still quarantining, we're all just going to be off work sick. Well, we're going to see. We're going to see what happens. We will uh, let you all know, of course, once we find out. At the moment, you do have to isolate for seven days if you catch COVID over here. And uh, for the last three days of that isolation, you have to be symptom-free. Oof. Busy in there. It is very busy, this little area now. Can you let me know the results of the meeting if it comes through? Yeah, if anyone if anyone does find out, I'm sure it will come up on the Canarian Weekly. Um, if it happens during the live stream, let us know. I'll uh, get Laura to check when we stop in uh, Beer Garden. We'll have a quick look. But I think it would be tonight. They will. Yeah, they normally let it out later this evening. I think. I think someone was in the Aberdeen Steakhouse and wanted us to wave. I think it's them there. There, there we go. <laughs> we'll quickly go and say hello. Let's quickly say hello. Let's quickly go and say to uh, this uh, hello to this nice couple here. <laughs> Hi, yeah. You okay? I met I, I met you the other day, didn't I? I think I remember. I remember. Yeah. You having a good day? Yeah, great day. You just having drinks or food as well? Nice. Yeah, you got all the way up there. Yeah, I remember now. Yeah. Yeah, because you had your t shirt on, yeah, I remember. Fourth prize winner. Your shirt will be home when at home when you get back. Yeah. Well lovely to see you again. Enjoy the sunshine. It's a gorgeous day. Oh well there you go then. Good. Good. Do it now while it's cheap, it's only gonna get more expensive. You too. Thanks very much. Have a good day. Oh, nice couple there. They came to meet me in the office the other day. Uh, he won the fourth prize of the 30,000 subscriber giveaway. Um, so he's got a nice T-shirt waiting for him when he gets home. See the police riding past there? Again, he's he's uh, pretty chilled there. It's a nice job, isn't he? Nice and relaxed. Not a bad not a bad job, is it? Cruising along. It's all just petty crime, yeah, all the pickpockets and things. This is the little permanent little Sunday market style thing that they have open here. Do you have to do the health control form? You do, that is still in place across the whole of Spain. You have to do the, uh, the QR form. It's very easy, it's very free, it's nothing major. Um, it is very simple. There's loads of videos and things online to help you fill it in if you do struggle with technology and things. It's it's nothing too bad. Uh, off to Matthew Street the weekend for pre-drinks. Very nice. Where are you now? Logged off for a bit. Uh, Debs, we are now in... We're in the middle of Las Americas. We're coming up to uh, Veronica's here. This is the main sort of Las America strip. And uh, Las America, I'd say, is uh, even a little bit busier than Los Cristianos. So it'll be interesting to see what uh, Adeki is like. A few people have said Adeki is a bit quieter. What about the locator forms? You still have to do them when you go back. And um, they are now, you can now fill them in three days before you travel. But you, at the moment, they've not been scrapped. You still have to do them uh, when you return to the UK. I think it's for, it's tracking people coming in from red list countries, but there's no real 
bad variants anymore so i think the red list thing is done anyway so it'll be scrapped soon they like to take their time Yeah, not one empty table there. Hi, yeah, you okay? Just getting ready for the airport, Budapest. Here we come. There you go, Dean. Uh, off to uh, Budapest. Very nice. Little weekend away. Got a nice view of the waves from here. That's nice. Oh, so sweet. Yeah, someone's on the vape. Fifty is following you, Andrew. I don't know what that means. Sorry, Tony. Uh, have a safe flight, Dean. Loving the live vlog, Andrew and Laura. A little bit of sunshine. I hope you are enjoying it. I'm looking forward to some lunch next. You guys are going to help me decide what I'm having. Laura's thinking cheesy chips and beans. Either that or a salad. Mm -hmm. a little healthy option, little healthy salad, eh? So I'm going to give you guys the option, should we stay on the beachfront or should we go along Veronica's? Let me know. We can either stay left or we can go right. I'm going to let you carry the bag in a second just because my arm isn't quite as stable with the gimbal with the bag on. Uh, beachfront, beachfront. It sounds extra nice, the waves on here, because you've got the, the pebbles. We did indeed, Sharon. Good point. Remind me when we get to beer garden, I'll reload with sun cream. Very good point, that was. Okay, let's keep on moving. Find the best valued restaurants. Okay, a lot of people want some cheaper restaurants, so I'll bear that in mind. Uh, we'll definitely do that. The last, uh, I think we, the last one we did was like an eight ninety five menu. And we really enjoyed it actually. It was in uh, Los Cristianos that one. We will uh, definitely do some more of them. No problem. Uh, left, of course, what have you? What's the temperature? It's about 25 at the moment. A few people saying hello. Um, this is a busy little area, that bit, with all the tables and chairs. Cute dog. The cheapest cocktail bars. Okay, getting some ideas, getting some ideas. Uh, we are in Los Gigantes and it's cloudy today. It looks sunny from here over at Los Gigantes. Looks like blue skies to me. Hi, are you okay? Yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah, no problem. Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, let me just get out of the way so that people can move. There we go. 
pole. Um, <clears throat> they're coming along when I can get a minute. I am planning on doing. Oh, sorry. Oh, in everyone's way. Do you want it one? Sorry, what? Do you want me on? There you go. <laughs> very nice. Thank you very much. How long are you over for? Three days left. Nice. Have a great time. Enjoy. Thank you very much. Lovely to see you. Yeah, yeah, no problem. No problem. Oh, thanks very much. No problem. Have a great time. Okay. Great to meet some people there. Some lovely pictures. If you do see us, make sure you say hello. We're open to anything. Um, do come and say hello. It's not a problem. I was uh, a little bit windy in that spot. I know. It was, uh, wind was picking up a little bit. Uh, you're always so lovely to everyone you meet. Oh, I, I enjoy it. I love it. It's, uh, it's good fun. a nice view down to the beach. You've got Papagayo Club which is open today. It's a little bit expensive in there. Now, where's the best pizza restaurant staying in Hotel Volcano? I'll let someone else answer that because I'm not familiar with that uh, with too many around that area pizza wise. So I'm sure someone will be able to tell you. If anyone knows my suggestions would be find an actual Italian. Yeah, proper Italian restaurant will do a really good Italian pizza. Can you say hello to Mal and Paul from Wirral? Hi guys. Uh, hello from Denmark, coming over in April, very nice. Uh, off for a nap before work. Enjoy Carl, thanks for tuning in with us. looks nice and busy. I'll pan around in a second and show you. Very busy. So it's quite tranquil along here. Yeah. Nice. Vlog idea, best local food. Okay, gives us a few ideas. A lot of people want cheaper restaurants, cheaper bars. So we'll, uh, we'll, we'll do a few of those. If anyone's got any really good favourite, like cheaper restaurants, your 8 95 meal deal ones, comment them after the video's finished and we can go back and have a look at them and research them. If you put it in the live chat, I probably won't remember. If you comment it properly on one of the videos, I'll, I'll be able to see it later on. Hi, are you okay? Yeah. That's a very Mick Garvey shirt, that one. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Thank you very much. You having a good time? Good. Yeah, thanks very much. Where are you staying? Ah, okay. Nice. Looks nice. Whenever I look through the glass there. Yeah. Oh, it's not bad. Eight weeks in total. Wow. You should have a good tan at the end of that then. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Yeah. Where are you off to today then? Just chilled or? Yeah, just with a drink. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> you too, lovely to see you. Yeah. I like the shirt. You've got to go for a fun shirt while you're here. Yeah, yeah enjoy your walk. Lovely to we see you. Now, we're on YouTube. There you go, you'll see yourselves on there. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, Have a great guys. time. Bye. Stay Bye. safe. Bye. Uh, lovely to, uh, you got another lovely couple there and they had a very Mick Garvey shirt on there, I'd say. Now this spot here is where um, a few days ago one of the subscribers was attempted to be robbed. So just be careful everywhere you go. I'm going to keep mentioning it. Um, there's, there's pickpockets out in force. Just be careful with your bags, your pockets, your wallets, etc. Because um, there is pickpockets around at the moment. Um, they seem to be on one. A lot of stories about it. So be careful if you're over or you're coming over. It doesn't matter what time of year. Watch out. Yeah, this this is a, for some reason this strip here is a little bit of a 
a hot spot for it for some reason, right in front of Palm Beach Club. Uh, let's see. Uh, toasties and sandwiches now being served at Yolo's, very nice. I think we had a toasty there once, but they, they hadn't sort of. Game. Yeah, they hadn't really added it to the menu yet. Yeah. That's good, good to know. We try and wherever we try and go in, it's always full. Yolo's, very popular. Every time we try and get in there, it's, it's full, we can never get in. Uh, liking today's vlog, Andrew, could you say hi to John and Maxine from Old Swan? Hi, John and Maxine. Hope you're well, hope the weather's not too cold. If you are enjoying the stream, hit the thumbs up. If you're new, a big welcome. Make sure you uh, hit the subscribe button. We've got Monkey Beach Club on the left here. I'll tell you what I have noticed, the breeze has definitely picked up the further we've come. Definitely a, a little bit more breezier down here than when we started in uh, Lost Chris. Kev H, nice to see you on, I hope you're well Kev. Didn't notice you there. Thanks for joining. Where are you headed? We are headed next to San Eugenio for a little bit of a bite to eat. And we're carrying on all the way. We've got a car parked waiting for us in uh, Del Duque. See the relay in the road here. That'd be nice, relaying the road on the, the tarmac on the one-way system. I am, yeah, they'll come along and do that in the middle of the night tonight, I think. Or tomorrow. They've relayed a lot of the roads, actually, to be fair. They're definitely spending some money in Arona in particular, Lost Chris, etc. A lot of the roads have been resurfaced. So I'm trying to think of the best route up to Beer Garden now. I think we're going to cut up in a minute. We'll stay on the beachfront and then we'll cut up. Oh, that big massive hill. Yep, we're going to cut up the big massive hill. <laughs> yep, we're going to earn our, our toasty, that's for sure. A nice view. Some big waves rolling in there as well. Yeah, because it's the direct of the wind's coming, isn't it? Show the best nature spots. You've given us plenty of ideas. We're definitely going to do some of those restaurants, as I said, so do comment those. Your favourite cheap three courses, 8 95 stem ones. And we'll, uh, we'll pick a few. We'll go and get them done. Do you want us to no, there's the next question we can either film them edited or we can film them live what would you prefer do you prefer live ones or do you prefer edited ones a bit like what we did with harley's do you prefer live or edited when we go and do these restaurants be fun jumping in those waves it would be they are uh, they're not too bad these ones just here you see people swimming in them they do look uh, quite fun Have you booked a table for lunch? I did message uh, the owner just to say we were coming in. So hopefully he saved us a table. I didn't think it would be this busy. I just sort of messaged like, oh, we'll be popping in. Um, but it's uh, busier out and about than I thought it was going to be. So I've not booked a table for a specific time or anything. I just let them know that I'd be popping in just in case they had music on or something because it's a live stream. A uh, bit of both, live. A lot of people want them lives, okay. A lot of people love the live streams. The only unfortunate thing with the live streams is they're not quite as good a quality in terms of picture quality. They're not 4K and they're not HD. Uh, that's not down to the equipment or anything. It's just purely down to streaming. Um, the 4G here won't stream any quicker. And it does stay at about 480p, 720 sometimes. Mile Sol. Nice in there. Everywhere's full. Bora Bora, it's a popular one. We've got another couple gonna say hello. Hello! <laughs> Hi, are you okay? Nice to see you. You too? Hey, it's a nice shirt. Thank you. Is that this season's? No, Last season's? 20... Ah, okay. It's nice that. Very nice. Yeah. You having a good time? Yeah, it's lovely. Good. Good. 
been watching them all the way down. Oh, thanks, mate. You're just having a few bits, nice. a little uh, nice cold beer there. It looks yeah. nice. Unless you're getting a beer garden. We were going to get a beer garden as well. Yeah. Nice, on the way back. Oh, get it's yourself nice in there. Shelter. It's nice. Yeah, it's a nice stop on the way back. Yeah. We're going to have a little bite to eat, I think. Yeah, then you get a car. Yeah, got a car and a decky waiting for us to uh, come back in. Oh, lovely to see you. Thank you very much. I was. We did a little bit earlier, yeah. Just I think we tried to catch the sunset this 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 weekend, but yeah, the weather's a bit better tonight as well. It is, yeah. It's nice today. Got here Tuesday, but the weather's been disrupted. Tomorrow is meant to be fantastic. A little bit mixed again on Sunday, but tomorrow is meant to be amazing. It is a little bit breezy, but sunshine. Yeah, we've been watching the waves down. Yeah, the massive. Been it down there. Yeah, big time. I think some of them are too big, only the professionals are going in. <laughs> but lovely to see you, enjoy your beer. Thank you. Thank you very much. Cheers, Laura. Thank you. Have a lovely day. Enjoy your walk. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, another lovely, uh, I think that's um, mum and son, I think that was. Thanks for saying hello if, you, if you're watching on catch up. I would try and stop for longer, but we've got to try and get back. Definitely got to be done. What time is it? It is quarter three. Quarter three, right, okay. We need it's to be off. I know, got to be off the live by latest five o'clock. We've got airport yeah. runs that we've got to do. Uh, my son would love one of those shirts. Where can you buy them from? Which one is it, Louise? And I can let you know. Is it the one I'm wearing? Or the Tenerife shirt that he was wearing? Or, yeah, he had the Tenerife football shirt on there. The best thing about the lives that we get a chance to catch you and say hello well thanks very much if you do see us uh, make sure you do say hello we do plan things very last minute we we're asking today where where would you know people like to see and then in the end we just thought let's just do a massive walk and show everywhere Uh, have you been to Baobab Hotel? Uh, I've delivered cars there before. It's very nice. But I've never been inside it really. I've been in reception. <coughs> very modern. Very nice. 738. Still tuned in. Thank you very much. Hit that thumbs up button. Give us a wave if you pass Guayamina. Okay, that was a little bit further on. That'll be after lunch. Uh, maybe a bloom. I hope that was. I, I, may, I don't know. I don't know. Um, we'll keep on walking, we're not, it's not, that's too soon to cut up that. Oh, these steps never get easier. Oh, my legs. <laughs> there you go, Laura's off. <laughs> I'm not that quick. <laughs> oh, boy. They don't get any less steeper. Oh, that's a nice view. It's hot. Hello. Okay. You okay? How are you, sexy boy? Good, thank you. That was another full restaurant there as well. Uh, the football share, you can get them in a lot of the sports shops. Some sell them, some don't. Just look out for some of them are fake. But in the, in the proper sports shops, you will find them. I think I got one for for Gaza's son Seb. We got that in the sports shop on uh, the Golden Mile. Was where we got that one from. Nice bird of prey up there. Missed him. You can see him there. Gliding in the wind. <clears throat> Can you 
Can you grab the Aquarius out the back, please, Laura? Yeah. Gonna have a quick Aquarius break. Open it for me. Um, <clears throat> mm. Oh, it's good. <laughs> it's all uphill in this direction. You, you don't realise. <clears throat> Coming the other way, it's a little bit downhill. Hi, are you okay? Thanks very much. Yep. Having a good time? Ah, okay. Enjoy the sun. Thank you. Follow me along on Facebook. If you don't already, make sure you do follow the, the Instagram. We do load little bits on Instagram that don't go on the YouTube channel. As if you follow us both, we do do little stories and things throughout the day of what we're up to, etc. Also as well, make sure you join the Night Strider fan group. We're nearly at 7,000 members now. A very friendly group, no funny business. Um, you can ask questions, etc. People post their pictures up in there. It's, uh, it's a nice friendly group. So if you're on Facebook, check that out as well. Uh, when your dad gets back, you need to take him to El Rodeo. He would absolutely love it. Okay, miss that Aquarius restaurant. Uh, that Aquarius is a lifesaver. I never used to like it. <laughs> Laura used to hate it. Used to, I'd have it on my own. Laura would never touch it. I'm into it now. It is just special, isn't it? Very full of all the uh, salts and things that you need to keep you going, it is keep you hydrated. In space. Yeah, bottle of that sorts of the hangover out a little bit. Good for your hangovers. another nice view definitely want to eat in that restaurant one day one day we will do that this is still technically Las Americas yep yeah. uh, five days I will be there how many days of work is that not many days? and it's nearly lunch time for us boy I'm hungry I've not eaten all day no, definitely time for a bite to eat my other half loves aquarius our room is full full of them when we leave especially the aquarius lemon they do orange and lemon and it's it's like if you're wondering what it is it's, it's a bit like squash it's not fizzy but it's not full of sugar either it's full of it's got a tiny bit of sugar in but not not like a lucas aid or anything um, it's low in calories, but it's full of all the salts and minerals and things that you need to stay hydrated. Oh, it's windy in this bit. Yeah, I think with this breeze, that's why these are all free. Gorgeous view from them now. Nice view of this pool beach club down here. This one, Las Rocas. It looks like a nice cheesecake. Does look like a good cheesecake. Gorgeous view though. So there you go, you've got food cocktails it's seawater in there you've got hammocks chill out beds cabanas you can even have massages as well and down open there at 10 open it from 10 yeah very nice Uh, yeah, we've gone past the Bougainville now. That was a little bit further back. I think. Have we gone past the Bougainville? Uh, no, I don't think we have gone past the Bougainville yet, have we? I can't remember. 
Yeah. I can't think now. No, I don't know. <clears throat> Uh, Anne and I did that walk a month ago. It was 60,000 steps between us, wow. So that's, that gives you an idea of how far you're walking when you do this walk all the way to Hideki. Okay. For now, though, it's lunch is on the agenda. Yeah, well, I'm getting pretty peckish lunch, now. Yeah. I am uh, feeling it now. Time for a little bite to eat, a bit of a boost. Thanks to, thank you for uh, staying on, everyone. We've had a steady 700 tuned in. As I said, a lot of you will watch on catch up, but I appreciate you being here live as well, chatting along with us. Uh, please, can you say hi to my four-year-old? Uh, I think that's Ronnie. Hi, Ronnie. Loves the videos. Hope you're well. Uh, let's cut up this one. We're going to cut up this one here because we can show you a little bit of the San Eugenio shopping centre, uh, which a lot of people like to see. Ooh. All uphill this. <laughs> Toasty and a portion of chips. I'm going to let you help. You're going to help me choose. I'm going to show you the menu and you're going to help me choose what I have for lunch. We'll see. I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm open to anything really. That does sound nice though. Toasty. I'll let you pick. Maybe. Maybe. It's a lovely hotel. It always reminds me of something. It's not very Spanish. It reminds me of something like Bahamas-ish or something Caribbean. Uh, have I ever been to La Branda Suites? I haven't. I've deli Again, I've delivered cars there, but I've never really done anything in. The reception of that one's lovely, the Hardin Tropical. <sighs> Feel those cars. It is hot. It's hot out the wind. <laughs> it is. A steeper hill than you think. Chicken wrap and chips. Ooh, nice. I'll let you pick. Let's see what we end up going for. Oh, boy. <coughs> you all right back there? I'm struggling for more. Oh. I think the calories burn. <coughs> I burnt some calories here doing this. Yeah. Ain't my lunch, definitely. I got up this morning and I exercised as well. I'm doing good today. I can't get up that early anymore. No way. I'm going to go buy it tomorrow morning for what it. Uh, wait for Laura. Laura's beating me. I'm Sushi and eggs for Andrew. <laughs> well, you know what I love. Yeah, I don't think she's getting in that. Put up a tight space that to try and get in with an audience. Will she do it? Don't think she's going to do it. No, I've got no chance. <laughs> oh, a butter chicken wrap. That sounds nice, that, Pauline. <laughs> that sounds nice. I had the leftover butter chicken last night. It was stunning. Loved it. Yeah, the next day warmed up. It's like even better than when you get it first time. San Eugenio Shopping Centre over there. Not too much change. Not too much really going on with it. This supermarket is getting changed a little bit. Other than that, not too much going on. Yeah, the mad roundabout. I uh, saw on their Instagram earlier they had uh, there was poli all police here and everything this morning. <laughs> yeah, there's something going on.
People just don't know how to move. Oh, I got through in the end. People don't know how to move. Exercise that make you look good when naked, so does alcohol. Choice is yours. Oh, I've done my exercise already. <laughs> okay, I think we'll go for this one. Oh, nice. Hi, are you okay? Nice. Came out today or last night? Not sure yet. I'm not sure. Oh. Good, thanks to you. Yeah, I'm knackered. Yeah, just a bit. Just a bit. Uh, what are you going for? Can I be a big lecture lecture, please? Yeah, yeah. Hot. With a fizzy water as well, please. Yeah, thank you. Oh, we're in. We're in. Here. Oh, it's hot. It is hot. So, I need you to get the menu up for me. And I need to get the wires out to charge some stuff. Oh, yeah, we're going to charge some stuff while we're in. I've just got to tell you, Ben. Yeah? You spend more time in our house than England on this burning tablet than you do out here. <laughs> But we're always following you to see where we can go next. So yeah, well you having a good time? Yeah, we're um, month this time. Okay, oh, not a month? Yeah, six weeks. Oh, I'll be back. Yeah. Nice. Do you Thank you very much. You do a good job. Yeah. I hope not. <laughs> Lovely to meet you. He's saying Everton are going down. Um, let's put the phone on charge for now. Uh, yeah, let's do that. We're going to put the phone on charge for a little bit. Come on. Hopefully there's no wind noise now because the fluffy thing has to come off. Let's just check this is on. There you go. My little battery pack's on. So, if you can get the menu for me. Yeah, no problem. I'll just say that you'll definitely Do you want to get a picture with him? Yeah, no problem. No problem. I'll get the menu up and see you these guys. So you got me for a minute. Oh, oh, I'm buzzing. It means. Ooh. Oh, come on, there we go. Hello? There we are. Thank you very much. So. Facebook, let's have a look. Okay, we are in. Here we go. Um, you get the menu up, yeah? I am, I am. I'm just logging in. Just logging in. You guys are going to help me pick my lunch here. Ten pints of shandy. That'd be nice. Oh, got a Diet Coke as well. That's nice. Oh. <laughs> I'll swap these around and I've got the fizzy water. Open in browser, okay. Uh, happy anniversary, Laura and Andrew. Thanks so much, class. I hope you're well. How's it going? Um, you're meeting a lot of your lovely subscribers today. We sure are. If you see us, come and say hello. Okay, here we go. So this is what is on the menu. We've got breakfast, so I could build my own breakfast. Uh, you've got vegetarian breakfasts, um, avocado smash, eggs benedict, egg royale. You've got breakfast bagels and sandwiches. So you've got bacon and egg, sausage and egg, cheese and onion toasties, cheese and ham toasties, burgers and bagels, beef burger, cheese burger, chicken burger, chicken and bacon bagel, salads, vegetarian salad, smoked salmon salad, chicken and feta cheese salad. And then your side orders, you've got hand cut chips, hand cut chips and cheese, what you like. Um, sweet potato fries, side salads, loads. Loads, loads on here. And I'm sure. The night's tried a cocktail for breakfast. Yeah. Maybe, might have one, maybe. They do have a night's tried a cocktail here. It's actually on the menu as well. It is. It is a very nice cocktail. So, what am I having, guys? What should I have? What should I go for? Let me know, cheese and ham toasted with chips. Mm. Chicken burger. Thank you very much. You're Thank you. Thank you. Wow. 
Come on, come on. A lot of people are saying cheese and ham toasty and chips. Yeah, I'm going to get cheese and chips. I don't do eggs, so no. I wouldn't do eggs benedict, would I? No. Far too posh for Andrew. Far too posh. Show us the all day breakfast. See, I could build my own breakfast. Again, I don't do eggs, but I could build my own breakfast. Yeah, if you go on the Facebook as well, you've got loads of, on the Instagram, you've got loads of pictures of what the food We've looks had, like. I've done a vlog in here with the breakfast, it was amazing. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. But uh, important message that though, I think. That's why I did it, yeah. I like the message. Yeah. I see all the signs now as well. The conservation was really good as well. Yeah. Yeah. All good. You keep it all right then, Yeah, all good. Knackered now. Little lunch break and then carrying on. I see what's on YouTube, which is always. Yeah. Yeah. You too, thanks for coming over. Tell them I said hello. Thank you. Hi guys, if you're watching. Um, have they got pancakes? No, don't do pancakes. It's, um, it's a small kitchen, so it's a small menu, isn't it? Got small kitchen, but... Everything that you need on it. What you get is good. It's not too big of a menu that they struggle. What they do is spot on normally. Yeah. So. Um, Mickey pancakes, syrup and bacon, that'd be oh. nice. Chocolate chip, Mickey pancakes, syrup and bacon. Like walking on a dream, that innit? Yeah. Wonder if anyone else got that. Oh yeah, you okay? I can't tell you how much I say wanna say thank you. Yeah. The last 18 months, you know, during all the aggro and everything. Yeah. I've sat there watching your vlogs. Fantastic. Thanks very much. Yeah. How long are you over for? 
Uh, we go back next Wednesday for 10 days with the last nice. Esther. Nice. And, uh, You've had a good time? Yeah, just steady, you know. Chilled. We were supposed to be coming um, the day after the original lockdown in, in, um, in England. Yeah. So everything was ready. We were all ready to go in the city go. So it's been a long wait. Yeah. And your friend Jet too paid up within 24 hours, so we're all right. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah, the, as we got to the vlogs, yeah. the best one was in the vault, definitely. The vault? No, oh, everyone loves the With vault. With all them rings. Yeah. Oh, it's, you pay the price, though, the next day. Right, for the next day. <laughs> yeah. Like, Good fun. I, I tell you what, Wendy watches the soaps in her bedroom. Yeah. Sorry, in the lounge. I'm in the daughter's ex bed. Yeah. You know, watching YouTube. Thanks very much. And, um,. <laughs> It cannot be. Hi guys. Right. Lovely Bye. to see Bye. you. Bye. Have a great time. I just got over COVID. Yeah. And I got a bit of a cough, and I couldn't stop that. Coughing myself to death, laughing. Oh no. Every time the bell rang, you know. Oh good. I'm glad you enjoyed them. Yeah. Yeah. So, I'm so glad I've seen you now. Thank you very much. Well, are you sitting in here? Or? In the corner. Yeah. We'll yeah. have a quick picture before we go. I'd like yeah. one, that's it. Yeah. I've actually got a nice ride over quite a tail. Ah, you've I've got... never drank a cocktail in my life. No? Do you like it? Yeah, nice. It's nice, refreshing, isn't it? Yeah, steady. Yeah. Good. Yeah, Wendy's coming in a bit. She's got, she's got bailies, but still, I'll let her off. No, well, come over, I'll get a picture with you in a minute. No problem. Lovely to meet you. Lovely to see you. Nice to hear that. Thank you very much. A lovely, lovely, another lovely couple there um, who's loved watching us during the lockdown and stuff. We got the order in. You ordered, yeah? yeah. Oh, they'll let you, let you spot on in here. Yeah. It is uh, very, very nice, a bit too nice. Uh, fizzy water with it as well because you've got to stay hydrated. Uh, you need pat patron. A lot of people have patron. I don't know whether I would or wouldn't do patron. I just enjoy doing the vlogs. I meet people like that. Make, makes my day. That you sat there, made up, enjoyed the vlogs, got them through lockdown. That's enough for me. Yeah. Um, it looks like the decision is toasty and chips. A lot yeah. of people are saying toasty and chips. So that's what we'll go for. Ham and cheese toasty. Big portion of chips for me. Cute little dog going past. So, what is everyone else up to today? We've been on for two hours now already. We've got a long way to go. Uh, but what is everyone up to? Is everyone having a good day? Are you new to the channel? If you are, let us know. If you are new to the channel, um, do say hello. We'll be there in two weeks. Looking forward to it. We'll maybe see if you do. Fantastic. Uh, nice ham salad baguette. Toast, you think? Oh, no, no salad for Aunt Jill. Nothing clean. Hang on. You okay? She's a bit camera shy. <laughs> <laughs> Hi! Can I yep. have a portion right. of cheese and chips and beans on the side? Cheese and chips. Beans on the side. With beans on the side, yes. Ham and cheese toasty with a big portion of chips, please. Ham and cheese toasty. I've not eaten all day. Right, okay. We've got another hour done. left to walk, so. Oh, that's right, it's done. <laughs> Cheesy chips, the beans on the, beans side. on the side, and then ham and cheese toast and a large chip. Yes. Perfect, Perfect. you've got it. Thank you very much. Um, she's not so shy, but she's not. That's lovely. Um, we are all working today. Sorry to hear that, Tony. I hope I'm cheering you up. Uh, on holiday tomorrow down to uh, Parran Port, caravan break. Very nice, Sharon. Have a great time. It's not sunny enough for my sunglasses, but it's too sunny to not wear them if you get me. Uh, just had a month in Tenerife, oh uh, so it's a nice break. Uh, nice to be back, all the housework, rug, wrap juices. Hi, are you okay? Hi, you're right. I have to cut these pictures. I've two years. Yeah. I haven't been able to come here, and then there we are. Oh, and nice. I've seen you at last. Yeah. Having a cocktail? Yeah, enjoying, enjoying it? it? Yeah. Good. My partner's coming, having the night strider, so... Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's lovely. Good. Oh, yeah. OMG sticks. Me and royalty. You having a good time? Yeah. We just How? arrived yesterday. Arrived yesterday, nice. Yeah. Which one? 
Where about? In an apartment. Okay. Nice. Ah, okay. Right in the middle. Right in the middle, yeah. How long are you here for? Just up. Yeah. Nice. It's uh, tomorrow's going to be really, really nice. Sunday a little bit, a little bit more mixed on Sunday, but it should be pretty much like this the whole time. I've just got one of your cocktails. It's really nice. Good. Good. Yeah, Ron. I'll uh, quickly uh, let you, anyone you want to say hello to. We've got 716 people watching. Just got that family. Yeah. Very nice. Seven grandkids. So. Seven grandkids. I bet they keep you busy. Yeah. That's why you escaped here. Yeah. Do you escape Christmas as well? All them Christmas presents. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Yeah. Beginning of December, we were there. Yeah. And now it topped up. Big difference to now though, with how many people are here. Yeah. Much busier. Yeah. yeah. Strange. Yeah. yeah. It is weird. It's hard to think back now to when it was that quiet because we're so used to it. Busy again now. Yeah. It's weird to think back when everything was a ghost town. Yeah. Lovely to meet you. Thanks for coming and saying hello. Thank you. Another lovely couple. We've had loads of people saying hello today. Hello. Fantastic. We'll put up with us, guys. Fantastic. We'll be over there next Wednesday. Fantastic. If you see us, come and say hello. Um, if you can do me a big favour while you're on the stream right now, hit the thumbs up button. It's the little like button underneath. If you are new, make sure you subscribe. Um, howdy from a crying Chelsea fan. Not good, Epic Phil. Not good. A lot of the uh, papers gave Everton a lot of stick yesterday. Now they've got a new story to write about. It'll all be about Chelsea. There's a lot of pogwash coming out about Everton getting a points deduction and all that nonsense yesterday, which was a load of clickbait headlines. You got a points deduction? No, that we were meant to be, but we're not. What for? Breaking the, breaking the rule. We already broke the rules, so we're already on the naughty step. What, what rules? In terms of profitability and things, um, we ain't getting a points deduction. I mean... But now they've got Chelsea to write about. It'll, they'll stop writing about Everton for a bit now. At what? How's it going to affect that really? He's not going to win anything. Points deduction will send us down. He's going down on your own anyway. You don't need a points deduction. <laughs> well, I tell you what, Chelsea at home, that'll be an easier game with no fans now, won't it? Chelsea aren't allowed any away fans in any grounds. Why is that? Because they've sanctioned the owner, Roman Abramovich, oh, haven't they? Well, he's one of his mates, isn't he? So, yeah. yeah. Uh, we'll be there next Thursday, staying at Royal Palm. Hope to see you. Have a fantastic time, Mark, Barbara. Uh, tell the reception or said hello when you check in. 169 days and counting till Costa a decky. Um, hope to see you both. Fantastic. Uh, keep going on the channel. Very informative. We will do. We will do. Yeah. We're going to keep going. Got a few things in the works. Got a, got some good ideas from you guys. Cheap restaurants. Yeah. That'll be the target the next few weeks. I'm going to do some of them for you. How's the coffee? Gone. Stunning. Stunning that was. It's a nice coffee in here. Nice coffee. If you follow on, on Instagram, you'd have seen we were here on Sunday morning, weren't we? Yeah. Came for a nice little uh, coffee and a bit of a bite on yeah. Sunday. Nice on Sunday. And you get a view of the mad roundabout here. It's, uh, you could hear people beeping before. It's a bit of a hectic roundabout, this one. I tell you what, people. All okay, yeah. oh, good, yes, thank you very you. much. People say about the um, brand out from Lost Chris, I think this one's a bit worse, isn't it? This one, yeah. Because it's technically two lanes, isn't it? But then it condenses into one. It's, uh, yeah, it's a bit. can be quite fun at peak time. <laughs> um, after we knock Everton out the cup, you can concentrate on the league. Well, we'll see, Alan, we're quite good in the cup. It's the league that's the problem. Where are you in the cup? Quarter finals. Then if we beat Crystal Palace, we're in the semis. Oh, look at that. So why are you doing good in one thing and not the other? Ask the players. Um, they're going the wrong way round. <laughs> yeah, just tuned in, we're about to tell you, we're in, uh, currently in the beer garden Tenerife for a bite to eat and then we're gonna be carrying on our little walk. We've got a car waiting for us at the GF Grand Hotel. And then we'll be uh, off to do some airport runs. We'll be getting the bus, I think. Yeah. We're getting the bus. No, I think no, we're avoiding no, the bus. No. We're avoiding the bus it. today. We've done it. You worked out. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna go up in two and back in one. Uh, we got the bus twice the other day, didn't we? 
Yeah, and the day before that we got the film. To be fair, if you get the um, Express, it's fun to sit down. The Airport Express is much better than the 111. Yeah. Much better. If you can't, enough to get the bus. And the Airport the Express, Express has just got a few tourists on it with a few suitcases. The 111 is a lot of residents coming back from the from the north. And you know, there's a, again, someone else playing their music loud the other day out of the speaker drives me nuts. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh there's the train, the famous train. So I'm going to ask another question. Here we go. What is your favourite thing to eat when you come to Tenerife? Is it a full English breakfast? Is it a bit of tapas? Is it a curry? I tell you what, when I first went abroad, I didn't go abroad for the first time until I was about 16, 15, 16. And I was made up that every day you had a full English breakfast. That is always a home a treat is the full English breakfast. But we went to Ibiza and we had full English every morning. Loved it. Nice. So back when I could eat, having a full English breakfast was the favourite thing. A lot of people will say, say fish. Uh, big juicy steak. Yeah, steak. I love steak on the stone in Los Chris. Um, Pauline Davies, first time in ages I've managed to catch a live. Thanks very much, Pauline, for joining us. Uh, have your coffee on me. Thank you very much for that, Pauline. I uh, did like your, your idea of a uh, butter chicken wrap. I do quite like that idea. Cheeseburger. Don't get them much in the UK, but we love them in Spain. That's interesting. Canary and potatoes. See, it's a whole mix. Yeah. It's a whole mix. Garlic chicken. Ice cream. See, yeah, ice yeah. cream. Coffee. Lachi lachi. There you go. I just love go. coffee. It's, it's interesting. So many different people have different. It's, it's amazing how your attitudes completely change to food and drinks as soon as you go abroad, isn't it? It is. It's uh, just eating the breakfast in the sun. It's the sun that really makes the breakfast. Really. Yeah. It's where you are that. I like to eat different when I'm away, so tapas would be my choice. Yeah, Very nice. There you go. If you're into tapas, you're sorted. Absolutely sorted. Yeah. Uh, mine always seems to be a liquid lunch. <laughs> Not among the liquid lunch. Your mum and dad will have a few of them next week, won't they? Yeah, if you like a little liquid lunch, I enjoy one with them. Aquarius after a night out. Yeah, spot on, Neil. Yeah. Aquarius is. Uh, I don't know what I'd, what I'd do without Aquarius. I know, that's your favourite trick, isn't it? We ever go shopping, just piles of bottles of Aquarius for you, isn't it? Yeah, it's all I have. Aquarius Zero. No calories, no sugar, but it's just so refreshing. Yeah. What time are we on? Half past three. So we've got an hour, got an hour or so. Yeah, We're going to have to be set. We're nearly there now though, aren't we? Uh, still a bit of a walk from here to GF Grand. Is it? It's alright though, because we're going to have the fuel of this, of this dinner. Oh, the dinner will just power us on. Yeah. Uh, why is the food abroad always better? I think it's where you are, Paul, like I was saying. I think it's the setting, and it's isn't it? having somebody else cooking it for you, yeah, and yeah. it's cheap, so you're not like, oh my god. It's different as well, I think. Yeah. Getting something a little bit different. We are Let You Let You Love Us now, Andrew. Uh, enjoyed them last week. Can't beat them. Can't beat yeah. them. Uh, having a meal at the Sun Inn, a lovely homemade dessert, very nice. Would you ever run a bar kitchen out in Tenerife? Mm. We'd own one, not run one. There's a difference. I wouldn't wait for somebody else to go if I could help it. No. You wouldn't at all. No. <laughs> um, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It's a tough industry. It is. It's a competitive industry. Uh, is the Palm Beach Club open? It is indeed. We walked past it a little while ago. It's fully open. Fully open. I like this. Beer garden. And all your, your cutlery and stuff comes in a little uh, plant pot. Yeah. I like that. Fun. Uh, my local was the president. Notice it's shut. Uh, I'll let you let you use a coffee. So what it is, it's, it's like a... Like a latte, but they put condensed milk in at the bottom and then you mix it up. And it's just like a sweet latte. The condensed milk makes the coffee very sweet. 
So rather than putting sugar in, it's like condensed milk instead. But well, then it's creamier as well because the condensed yeah. milk sticks is a lot creamier. Yeah, it's creamier. Yeah. It's it's like a creamy sweet latte. Yeah. It's lovely. Spanish toasty and a donut. See, Spanish toasties with the Spanish bread. Spanish bread again is very sweet. Yeah, very different. So a lot of people like the toasties. If you're a sweet tooth, a Spanish ham and cheese toasty with the Spanish bread is actually quite but sweet. We also love a croissant, ham and cheese croissants out here yeah. as well. So do I. Croissants are a bit more sweet on the nice yeah. and buttery. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Spanish love anything sweet. Love it sweet. Have a nice day, Laura and Andrew. Thank you very much. Any recommendations for a cannabis club? Not in particular. It's not really our thing. Uh, I know there's some around, but it's not really our thing. I'm sure you'll be able to find one. There's plenty around. Uh, pick the leaflets up, Andrew, and put them in the nearest bin. Oh, our favourite leaflets there. Yeah. Yeah, you'll see them everywhere. You'll see them everywhere. Oh, it was our dinner. Mm, that was quick. Hey. Look at them more. They look good. So thank so you very much. You're very well. Yeah, be nice enjoy. and busy. Yeah. 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 There's been an accident on the motorway because I was nearly ah, in it. Really? Ah. You had something going on this morning as well, didn't you? Saw on your Instagram. Yeah. There was all police here and yeah, there was. There canine was. dogs and everything. Yeah. So everyone's diverting. So yeah. that's why it's so busy. They're all coming off the motorway and coming round. <laughs> See, there there's always something fun going on. So, so trying to avoid the accident on the motorway, they're all coming back this way. That is not good for us. We've got to go to the airport. Uh, okay, let me show you what we've got here. This food looks fantastic. They are proper American looking fries. Laura's just sprinkling a bit of salt on for me. My toasty looks amazing. And Laura's cheesy chips and beans look uh, spot on as well. Oof. There's people beeping, people not happy. Looks lovely this. Look at all that cheese. Alright, hold your horses. It's good. Mm. Very cheesy. Yeah. Mine is as well, look at that. Mm. Yeah. I just love cheesy chips. It's a lovely toasty, that. Lovely toasty. And cheesy chips are made my tango pure. It's a big portion of chips as well. I wish I'd make nice big bowl, yeah. Very good point, Sharon. We're gonna do the sun cream in a minute. Reload on the sun cream. Yeah, it's a bit red on your neck. I know, I'm a, I can feel it on my neck. Cheesy chips with plenty of salt vinegar. Lovely, that. Absolutely lovely. Me and my girlfriend heading to Costa Silencio in three weeks. We'll come and say hi. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Whoever said cheese and ham, toasty and chips, spot on. You got it. You got it right. It is lovely. This. So we've got a long walk left as well. I know. All the way through Fanny Bay and everything, yeah. Quite a sound, I've got a nice long way to the motorway. But which way is it? Is it going to the airport? The way we're going. But then at this time of day, it's chocolate anyways, isn't it? It Didn't took me the other, the other week an hour to get home from a decky. An hour. Yeah. Jeez. Gangster in his Renault again. Jeez. I know. He's nearly just hit the back of that one. I don't think he's going to get home any quicker. I know.
Sorry guys, we're just going to enjoy this. <clears throat> and then we'll be back on the move. This was much needed though. Yeah. Mm. Andrew's Ventacart is in Los Cristianos, isn't it? Yep, Los Cristianos is where you'll find us. Look at the cheese on that. Oh. Yeah, we were sat in the castle, lovely to see you, thanks for saying hello. Any poor stealers on the island? Uh, there is one in the north, a small one I think. So we've got our five horse one, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Uh, I love cheesy chips and gravy. Yeah. Nice. Angela, Laura, thanks for learning how to send messages to you both. Had a great day yesterday. Thank you very much. Looks like all these wacky bases here. It's quite fun to watch, actually. I'll turn it around actually, show you a bit of the bit of the uh... Yes, we do do daily hire, yep. Yeah. Yep, you can rent for a day. Uh, we love the videos you make, thank you very much. That was um, Ola Fur, thank you very much. Um, cheapest jet ski rental. I'm not sure, we're more into the ocean carts at the moment. Ocean carts, fantastic, I wouldn't really know. I've not done jet skis for a while, so I'm not 100% sure. Someone land and have a look, you'll find something online. Yep. Um, last time I did jet skis was a private one. Oh, it was yeah. A, it was a friend's jet ski, not a, an excursion. You enjoyed it, yeah? Yeah, it's, it's, it's on slow mode, Tony, so if you comment, you have to wait another 60 seconds before you can comment again. It just slows it down a little bit for us to read it a little bit easier. Um, thanks very much, Paul. He's put the link to uh, the car hire there, sanasi.com. If you need a car in Tenerife, make sure you check us out. It's very busy at the moment. Make sure you book in advance, whoever you're going with, uh, whether it's us. Try and support a small family business if you can, but whoever you're going with, book it in advance. It is very busy for cars at the moment. There is a shortage. It's very hard to get new cars, more cars. Ocean carts, I've done them on the channel. You'll see them. Uh, they're like a go-kart, but they're in the ocean. So it's like a jet ski, but you sit inside it and you drive it a bit like a jet, like a like a go-kart. They're amazing. Way better than jet skis. And in my opinion, they can go a lot faster. And I'll make them a lot easier. They're a lot more comfortable, I'd say. Yeah. You alright there, Laura? Yeah. It does look good to be fair. They're um, proper American style fries with the bits of skin on the end. Yeah, and the clean as well. Is it scary being at the same height as the ocean? No. No, it's, it's, just, it's almost like sort of sitting in a boat, but no, it's good. It's, it's very. I wouldn't say you were that much lower than a jet ski, but the difference is you're sitting inside it, not on it. It's uh, it's, it's real good fun, really good fun. So you're a lot more. Safe. You'll, you'll see if you if you have a look on the channel, you will see. Just search Ocean Carts Tenerife. You'll see the videos will come up. You can see exactly how much it is, what it's like. We love it. Um, I'm going again in, in a week or so with uh, Laura's dad. Yeah. So much so, my mum wants to try them. She's petrified, I mean, petrified of water. 
Um, she wants to try them. I don't think she'll end up doing it, but she wants to try because she's seen how nice they are. My dad, who's, who's 60 odd, would not go on a jet ski, but he loves these things because he knows he can't fall off. <laughs> All good. Thank Spot you, on. Yeah. Spot on. Enjoying the bedlam. <laughs> Um, just in from work, we're in Beer Garden Tenerife right now. We've walked all the way from uh, Los Cristianos, and uh, after this, we're going to be carrying on all the way to uh, Del Duque. What we've got to bear in mind is, guys, even if you watch on catch up, we've got to hope that the signal stays strong enough um, around Fania Bay. It does drop out very often. So I'm going to hope that, you know, we're not going to have, we might have a little bit of buffering going on. That area is notorious for bad signal. I don't think there'll be any pudding, no pudding. Mm. Toasty was amazing. Really enjoyed that, needed it. Uh, we booked Ocean Cart 16th of June and got a discount, so thank you. Uh, also managed to book Taipan, Vegas Girl and Overseas. Fantastic choices, brilliant choices. Uh, do you hire out seven seaters? We do, yeah. Uh, on also on YouTube recently, if your pick quality is on auto, it sends it down to the lowest quality. You need to manually choose quality to get the best screen. Is that on uplo on uploads? I've got it on the best quality. It goes on to 4K. But live streams, no matter what settings I do, it always it's like 420. It all depends on the signal strength, and it all depends on the 4G, 3G. Um, I can't I can never get it any higher than that, no matter what setting I seem to do. Nutters. Well, you're not going to get anywhere any quicker, are you? It's log Hello. jam. Road rage, I'm it? Just a bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You okay? Yeah, ah, you okay. Yeah. Ah, okay. You okay. I know. Mad. <laughs> Good, thanks to you. Enjoying it. Yeah, it's about 25 today. Yeah. It looks like a wacky base as well. This, this hot. Be like this again tomorrow. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah, little break. Definitely. Definitely get yourself back then. Probably in the summertime. Yeah. People say it's too hot, so I don't know. Because I like hot. This is hot. It is hot in the summer, you're looking about 28, 29. Feels like that now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you might struggle in the summer then. I think, like I say, I get on with some, but I'm really sore, is yeah. I think it's the mouth that could have been people saying, yeah, the mouth, don't you? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. You're still tan through it, yeah. Yeah, we're live, yeah. I'll come and say hello in a second. Oh, my yeah. believe you have a it feels, in the sun, it feels really hot. The breeze is nice, the breeze cools it down, but in the sun, it's really, really hot. What's nice? Very good, hot guys. Thanks very much. Oh, I agree with him, it's boiling. Yeah. It is hot now in the sun. We're going to have to start making a move. We are. We're going to reload with some sun cream. 
And I'm <laughs> gonna pop the toilet. Oh. Beep, 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 it's all going on. People are beeping like people just sitting in the middle of the road. Oh, there you go, someone, someone just shouted Laura and Andrew out the car. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna pop the toilet. Can you ask for the bill as well, please? Yeah. That was lovely, absolutely lovely. Not had the toasty in here before, I've had breakfast, I've had bagels, not had a toasty. Toasty was spot on. Uh, we've got 725 tuned in. Uh, stick with us guys, we're now gonna start walking again in a moment. Uh, I'm gonna grab my sun cream out of my new backpack. Just gotta find my Laura's pudding. You okay? Yeah, yeah. Actually, you know when your mum and dad was here the other week? Yeah. He said that the miss that wants to go to a Cantonese but didn't have time. The, uh, which one? They were disappointed. You said they were disappointed because they wanted to go and they didn't have time to go. And Wendy wants to go to a Cantonese one night. Cantonese? Or Chinese? Oh, overseas. Yeah, it was overseas that. So that's something near you, isn't it? Near Las Cristianas? Yeah, yeah, Passarella Centre. All right, yeah, what is. the hell is yours? Yeah. You'll be happy about that. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's nice in there. You'll enjoy it if you go. It's uh, spot on. Well, we went to the Paradise Park a couple of Christmas ago. Yeah. Um, so we know where it is, but she doesn't like the hell. So, if not, Taipan in Las Americas is very nice as well on the Golden Mile. Oh, yeah, it's nice yeah. in there as well. Yeah, we walked past there last night. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. right, Still going so off. I'll be over in a second. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, no problem. Yeah. No problem. I'll just go with the bike, so don't worry. Yeah, no worries. Uh, okay, Laura's just paying the bill and then we will be uh, making a move. Yeah, all done. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, it sounds like wacky races there, it is a bit. It is. I don't know where Laura's put the sun cream if she's even brought it. Where's the sun cream, Laura? Did you bring it? No? 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 Unless it's come out the bag. I don't know if we bought the sun cream. No, we didn't bring the sun cream. That was silly. Okay. Considering last time, Alright. Thank you very much. There you go. Beer Garden hooked us up there. Thank you very much. Um I appreciate that. There you go, nice little toasty for us. Spot on. Thanks very much, Beer Garden. Um where are you at the minute? We are in Tenerife Beer Garden. There you go, answer the question. We didn't bring any extra sun cream, but I am layered up, so um yeah, we'll leave that, leave a good tip for them. Um <clears throat> let me take the charger off. Back. There we go. And I'll put the rest of my water in as well. In there. Okay, we're going to take up a walk now. We're going to have to motor. It's going to stay in that one. Okay, perfect. I've got to do a quick picture. We need to put the fluffy mic back on as well, please, Laura. If you do the fluffy mic. Yeah, you go give that to them and say thank you. And I'm just going to put the mic on, guys. I'm sorry if it jiggles. It's hard on my own. And then we've got, and, ooh, there we go. There we go. Ooh. And we're all ready to go. Hang on, hang on, hang on. There we go. We're all ready to go. There we go. Are we all sorted now? Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Do you enjoy it? Yeah. Get your little screen. Fantastic. Hi, everybody. Where are you off to now, Laura? We're walking all the way down to do GF Grand. Do you want to put me eye watch on and get us some steps? <laughs> Somebody said it's about 30,000 steps somewhere. We've done it, it too, yeah. So 30,000, guys, yeah. Oh, you have to get your stretching in tonight. Oh, Jeff, that's morning as well. Oh, yeah. yeah. Check you out. Oh, you're good. I always exercise. You do. Yeah. And I've seen yeah. your bloody curly hair. It looks nice. Yeah. 
It's easy. I can eat it, Tim. Yeah. Oh. Sorry for interrupting. <laughs> <laughs> have a, have a good walk, but Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Alright, Andrew's just speaking to some people. So let's get this on him. So there you go, guys. So Andrew's just saying hello to you. To you. Thank you guys, bye! Bye guys! Thank you. Oh, bye guys! Oh. Here we go guys, just saying hello to some more. So we're gonna go off now. Oh, sorry guys, I can't work this this thing. That looks about right, doesn't it? There we go. Oh, no, it's not going well for me. So we'll keep going to the GF Grand now. Keep going and enjoy ourselves. Just one last look at the right crazy round that's as well for you before we go. Oh, have we got any comments? Thank you very much, guys. Oh, I'm trying to read. He's brandy and sugar together. It'll be gone within a day. I don't think one of my colds will. My, my body can't fight off any sort of bugs, it's awful. Oh, there we go. GF Grand, you'll like GF Grand, Tony. Bye guys. Oh, we've got to walk this way. Okay, so I've got the backpack on. We're all ready to go. And you can hold the camera. I can't hold okay, the camera. I'm back, here we go. So, um, lovely to meet everyone in there. Loads of people saying hello. Andrew, man of the people, I don't mind chatting. I've just got to try and motor now. Yeah. It's uh, we've been a little bit longer than I always think we're going to be. And now we've had our fuel. Fueled up. That was a lovely toasty. That was chips were spot on as well. I just eyes bigger than belly. I ordered a large portion. I was never going to eat that many. <laughs> but you know when you when you're starving, you think you are. I know. But <clears throat> lovely toasty that. Very nice. And you get to see the madness at the roundabout. <laughs> Oh, it is, yeah. The minute you come off that little stretch there, nice and quiet. So we're going to go back onto the beachfront along Puerto to Colón, along Fania Bay, and hope the signal holds out for us. does look stunning I can see everything jet skis parasailing we'll walk along this path I've not walked along this one before birds tweeping away tweeping yeah tweeting. I always say tweeping <laughs> Uh, give us a wave if you pass Grimina Princess, I will do. Uh, go from starving to bloated, yeah, yeah, you're right Sharon. You go in and you're like ravenous and then come out and I've eaten too much. <laughs> oh, it's nice down here in the shade. Another great vlog, thank you very much. It is a long one today. Um, if you're watching on Catch Up, thank you very much. If you've stuck with us for the whole time so far, 160 minutes, what nearly th nearly three hours. Thank you very much for uh, staying with us. Now, Adeki was the most requested. When I asked earlier what where people wanted me to go live, Adeki was the most requested. So this area should gain a little bit of interest. 
we'll see what's going on. As I said, just bear in mind, we might experience a few signal dropouts. Fania Bay area is notorious for it. Uh, same as Del Duque area as well. Signal is notorious for being uh, a little bit poor. And now we're back down to uh, a bit of a sea breeze as well here. Yeah. I'm going to have a nice afternoon kip after this. I wish I could. We're straight into the airport runs then. <laughs> Little afternoon nap sounds nice. Going down. Uh, you and Laura deserve all the success in the world, the way you chat and say hello to everyone. Thank you very much, Paul. Uh, all the walking you two do must go through a lot of trainers. To be fair, I do actually a lot with work as well. Um, I normally do go through. I don't. Normally about two pairs a year I have. They just get wrecked with work a lot as well, cleaning the cars and stuff. There's that shop that there's not many of them around them. Alley hops. <laughs> so we're about to see. Some people said to me that this area was a little bit quieter than the others. Looks busy to me. It's always booming up there, the keg and chair. It's always live music going on. Always sounds great. I'd say the bars and restaurants aren't as busy though. Odd to see there, only a few tables in compared to the rest. Uh, definitely time for some 5G masts. I'd love that. Uh, when we did live streams in Florida, there was 5G, and a lot of the stream was coming through in almost full HD. Yeah, everyone was commenting. Everyone was, yeah, everyone was saying the quality is fantastic, whereas here, just signal strength and things just isn't quite as good. Uh, how many of the, we've got 770 tuned in, how many of you have just joined us or just tuned in? And how many of you are new to the channel, if you are, say hello. Nice bit of sand sculpture. Have you ever put your feet in those fish tanks? No, never, never. They're not meant to be very hygienic from what I've heard. Never done it. I'd probably be laughing my head off anyway because I've got tickly feet, so. <laughs> uh, I'm new, hi Debs, thank you very much. Welcome to the channel. I hope you're enjoying it. Hi David, hi Lorraine. I'm new, Glenn, hi Glenn. Welcome everyone that's new. Thank you for joining us. So this is La Pinta Beach, if you're wondering. I'm 10 till 6. This one is called La Pinta. It's right next to Puerto Colón. I was just there. Been on from the start. Uh, where's Thursday afternoon gone? Great live. Thanks for staying with us. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Walking near Kaluna Beach there, booming away. Sounds like party time up there. Sounds like nap time to me. Hi, I'm old. I know you're uh, always around. Tony Such, you've been on for a while as well. Thank you very much for that. Oh, I tell you what, I think as the sun gets lower in the sky, it seems to be getting hotter. Yeah, it's right on my forehead now. <laughs> 
Look how clear that water is though, guys. Look at that. That is some clean, clean swimming water that is. Yeah, I remember that. Stingrays came in, that was, uh, we didn't have a channel then. Gorgeous. Love this viewpoint, you get to see all the water sports from here. They've probably made a fortune today. Jet skis, parasailing, banana boat, fly fish, you name it. Very well designed. They're coming in June, can't wait. Gorgeous view. Thank you for doing the live. Really hope I can go this summer. I hope so too, Molly. Uh, Sarah Kate, enjoy my last day as my sister of uh, maternity leave. Jude and I thought we'd check in with uh, Uncle Andrew and Auntie Laura. Hi, Jude and Sarah, hope you're well. Thanks for joining us. I bet you wish you were here. Maybe a little boat trip or something. <laughs> And there's Kaluna Beach up there. Busy, busy party time. I've uh, been watching you from the start. Been a lovely afternoon. Thank you very much. As long as you've all enjoyed it, we have. I hope you have as well. You never know sort of how it's coming across on TV while you're here in person. You know, I can see everything in real time, but for you, I hope the screen, etc., isn't too shaky, etc. Bit of one more time. It's proper party time, isn't it? See you dancing. <laughs> Does make you want to party that place, but that's a, that's a hangover from hell. That place for me. Drinking, drinking in the sun, I would really struggle in there. Um, it's fantastic, thanks very much. Love that view. Well, this is this was the most requested area of Daki now. We're in a Daki, we're above Fania Bay Beach here. I'm gonna say it one more time, just bear in mind the signal might drop out at a few points along this way. The last three streams I've done along here, it just kept dropping out the signal. So just bear that in mind, stay tuned. If it does drop out, don't panic. It will come back on um, after sort of a few minutes. Oh, uh, will we go to another bar? I'm not sure because we are on a bit of a time constraint now. Uh, I've got to be back at the car by five-ish, especially with traffic on the way home by the looks of it. This is the uh, famous blue cactus. Some seats available in there as well. Give you a little view down to the beach. It's getting a bit more calmer. Yeah, I'd say it's, yeah, I'd say it's a little bit calmer. It seems to be getting warmer, less of a breeze. Let me know what you think. A few people said to me when they came in the office that this area was quieter than the rest. Let me know your thoughts. If you've been on the stream or you've watched, seen it each area, let me know if you think this is any different. I'd say very slightly, but nothing, nothing major. I'd say all the bars and restaurants look a little bit quieter, less full. Can I have a t-shirt if you want? Any of the Night Strider t-shirts, they're all in the description, in the, the link, nightstrider.com. Loads of recommendations on there as well, don't forget. You can get discounts on some of the excursions and restaurants, etc. little freebies. Look at that for a view, though. La Gomera, lovely and clear today. Jet skis. Oh, you can just see La Palma. I don't know if you're going to see that on the camera, though. You very slightly just see it. Yeah, you can see the bump. I don't know whether it's going to come out on camera right here. Seems quieter. 
does seem very, very slightly, nothing too major. I'd say the bars and restaurants look a bit quieter. Ooh. We've got the uh, Elvis bar there. Another alley hop, in case you didn't go to the one 100 yards down the road. <laughs> Looks quieter than last week. I'd say so, it does seem, does feel a bit quieter. There you go, the moon, moonlight bar is back open. Anyone who was wondering, they had a little bit of a refurb. They put these glass screens in. I think they've redone the floor as well. But the moonlight bar there, back open again. This is lovely, it's a selfie stick. Thank you very much. Yeah, all back open. So if anyone's wondering, I know that's a few favorites, that one. It is all back open again. I think they put those nice glass screens in. I don't know whether it was that glass before, if someone can tell me. I don't know whether that was glass before, but I suppose you get a better view through the glass there. But there you go, Moonlight Bar back open. Fantastic. Now, do you want us to go along the beachfront? Or do we stay along the back? Let me know. We can either go along the back or we can go along the beachfront. What do you think? Uh, it was busy. No, it was ropes. Okay, so it was ropes before. They've got nice glass there now. Do like that. So, are we going down? Or are we staying up? Staying up, going down? That's, there you go. That's a question for Everton, that, isn't it? Going up, going down. Staying up, going down. <laughs> stay on the path. Stay at the back. Wherever the signal's better. I suppose it's slightly better up the back, maybe. Uh, if you did see or you're new to the channel, we've done this restaurant. We did it, I think, nearly two, I think it was two weeks ago now, uh, Luma. It was, uh, it was good. Service was fantastic. Very fast. It's a massive restaurant. This has taken over Champions and uh, Mamma Mia. Hi, are you okay? I think, were you the ones that wanted me to say hello? I think. You okay? Enjoying it up there. Have a great time. Lovely to see you. I think if you're watching guys, I think you're the ones that said uh, say hello if you go past. Um, have a great time if you can uh, hear me on here. Yeah, this is where we went. Sat in the middle there. It was good. Okay, you can have fresh lobster as well fresh fish and then you can see right into the kitchen through the windows uh, Tony Such thank you very much thanks for supporting the channel uh, thanks Andrew and Laura for another great vlog thank you very much Tony for joining us uh, really appreciate it we'll put that towards our next drink it might be at the airport at that point <laughs> uh, no thank you very much for that really appreciate it It is hot with no breeze. Still Huge though. difference. I would have to agree though, it is quieter. Okay. And I'd say the bars and restaurants this are quieter. Is, yeah. But then this area does have a lot more five star all inclusive. So if you're all inclusive, you're not going to be in these as much. Oh, those cakes look good. Some good looking cakes in there. <laughs> yeah, if you can hit the thumbs up button, we've got 779 thumbs up. If we could get a thousand thumbs up would be amazing if we can. I don't understand that. What, what, what city is that? 
Chelsea today? Who's playing Chelsea? Who's playing Chelsea? I don't know, I don't think so. <laughs> Somebody doesn't like the team playing, <laughs> unless we're just... Uh, afternoon, Carl's Place, how's it going? Thanks for joining. Let's have a quick look at the view from up here. Uh, Norwich City it is. I don't know why. Don't know where they got NOB from then. <laughs> there you go. Lovely view right over Fania Bay Beach. Yeah, all yeah, as Laura says, the beach clubs are a little bit quieter. Two. Yeah, so again, but it could be because the five stars are full, people in there, couldn't they? Yeah. People eating in the hotels a little bit more. Could just be the time of the day now as well. We are going more into the mid-afternoon. People aren't eating really at this time. Right, what time are we on, Laura? We're on five past four, we're doing well. Five past four, we're not doing too bad at all. We might even squeeze in another drink break. Because I tell you what, I'm thirsty again already. <laughs> A uh, big shout out to you both from Phoebe and Lacey. Loving the lives. Thank you very much. Oh. It may not look much on the camera, but uh, this is one epic walk. <laughs> you know, when you're heard, you're like, oh, yeah, I've lost Chris too. Del Duque, it's not that far, we'll do that. <laughs> so when you get to about here, you realise just how far it is. Yeah. <laughs> I will need another drink break, I'm starting to feel it in my legs. Getting jelly legs. <laughs> I'm not doing too bad. Yeah, you're looking alright, there you got the backpack on and you're, you look... You're not quite as tired as me. Look, I'm in shape, you see. I suppose you get up and exercise in the morning, I don't. Yeah, <coughs> uh, your blog picture's gone really big. That is just the signal in the area, I'm afraid. That is all down to the signal. I did warn you. <laughs> Back, I can't believe how far you've walked. Just sleep well tonight. Sure will. How was the eye test, Mum? Hi, I'm new. Hi, Jade. Welcome to the channel. <sighs> we'll stop for a little drink somewhere. I'm going to have to. <laughs> Uh, very practical with the rucksack, uh, very sensible lass. We did just get this rucksack, I mentioned it at the start of the video. Love it, absolutely love it. Richard and Dalcina from Scotland, who's taken over the championship bar. It's called Luma. We did try it on the channel two weeks ago. It was actually very nice. I think it's part of a hotel group. It's a, it's a big restaurant. Oh boy. I don't know where to stop for a drink. I could do with a drink here, I think. I'm really starting to flag a little bit. They're all reserved, but if you could get a quick drink in here, I'd have one. You think you could get one? In here. <laughs> yeah, even if it's just a bottle of water for now, I need a quick sit. 
That's uh, it's hit me quite quick. This lovely in here, though. These are all fresh vegetables growing on the uh, plant here. It is nice. You might have to go down to order. Um. Oh, I just need to sit. Yeah, please. Oh. Oh, it's all of a sudden just hit me. I was feeling a little bit uh, wobbly there. It is hot today. I think we walked a bit too fast. <laughs> There's a bit of music we'll have to talk over. I'm just gonna, just gonna have a quick drink. But the view is stunning from here. Very nice. Coming over in May, can't wait. I think I've, because uh, well, I'm talking as well, as long as I'm, uh, while I'm walking along, it's, uh, love the color of the rucksack. Can you, we have a review later. I will be reviewing it properly on the channel. And um, there's a link in the description if you want to check them out. Very popular bags. Um, they've got a lifetime warranty. I'm absolutely made up with it. It's a bit of a camera specialized bag, that one, for me. It's closed, gotta go down. Oh, right, okay. Don't worry then. We'll, uh, we'll keep moving. We'll keep moving. I've had a sit. We'll keep moving and we'll grab a drink along the way. We'll grab one. I think it was going to take a bit too long there anyway. I think we'll grab one from that little kiosk around the corner. We'll do me. Oh. I was saying, I think I've walked a bit too fast and I'm talking, so it's uh, you get out of breath a little bit. Probably dehydration as well, it's very hot. Is there any Aquarius still left in the bag? I'll drink this little bit of Aquarius, I could do with a cold drink. Uh, what gimbal do you use? I've got the DJI Osmo 3, I think. I am going to be upgrading to the new one soon. Uh, I think this one has, has done its mileage now. And uh, the new one does have big extendable arm, so I'll probably maybe upgrade to the new one soon. Oh, I needed that. I needed that. I don't think it matters whatever fitness you've got. I'm not the fittest, I'll admit, but whatever fitness level you are, this walk in this heat yeah. will dehydrate you no matter what. Yeah, the heat gets you the sun you don't realise because you're walking in a breeze, do you? Yeah, you've got this, the sun is well and truly baking my forehead right now. <laughs> Oh, needed that. Aquarius, hit the spot. Uh, wish I was walking with you. Well, you are virtually. If I could give you a bit of smell of vision award, let me let me sit you on this wall for one moment and just I let you take in this view. Yeah, if you have got a treadmill in your living room, you could have done this walk with us. If you kept going, would you end up at Hard Rock? No, it's, um, you can't walk all the way to Hard Rock. One, it's just too far, but there's no promenade connecting it. That's the problem with Hard Rock, where it is. It is tucked away a little bit, and you do need a car or taxis. Oh, boy. I imagine it was placed there for a reason. I think so. The area around it is just not quite up to scratch yet. I'd say I think in a few years it will be, but there's the area around it is... But I suppose that's what they want because they want people eating in the hotel, they want people staying in the hotel. But the restaurants and things around it are not quite up to standard in my opinion. Um, there's a little shopping centre next door which is a bit derelict and very run down. But I think, to be honest, I think they built it where it was because I think it was the only place that would give them permission to do a high rise the way that they did. And then they still had to build another high rise for the government, didn't they? Yep. To get the permissions. So for they them, to do a lot of hoops. yeah, to build those two high rises, they had to also build two high rises that the government could use. It's, it's like a weird rule. They had to jump through a lot of hoops to get those two high rises that they wanted. I think so, you just got no chance. Yeah. A hat really important, it is. Um, a lot of people have ordered the Night Strider hats, including myself. It's at home in Liverpool waiting for me and my dad is going to bring it over. 
Uh, but yes, you're very correct. Oh yeah, you okay? Yeah. Oh, thanks very much. Oh, and just arrived, yeah. Nice. How long are you here for? A week. Nice. Fantastic. Where are you staying? Nice. No, I struggle with this. I struggle with this just because of the. Uh, but no, I am due to do the GF fan you very soon, hopefully. It's in a good spot. Yeah. Right, all good. Long walk. Gone all the way from Lost Chris. <laughs> yeah, we've been on for like three hours. <laughs> yeah, been a long one today. No, no, we've got a car at the other end. <sighs> yeah. No. <laughs> Have a fab time. Thank you. Enjoy. Just arrived for a week. How jealous is everyone there? Uh, Strider, what's going on with the toffees? Um, not so good. Not so good. We'll see. We've got to win every home game, basically. Or most home games. Okay. Yeah, so I will be wearing a hat once Dad brings it over. I've got my Night Strider cap on the way. Um, I didn't get it delivered here simply because Tenerife is experiencing a big postage delay. We received a package yeah, yesterday with, with my rucksack. My rucksack arrived. And then with that came a lovely package from a subscriber June, from Christmas. June all the way from Christmas time. They sent it, it was a Christmas pack and it only just arrived yesterday in March. And it was sent, I think, early December. Before Christmas, it's Christmas socks, Christmas sprouts. Christmas yeah. Punch. Thank you very much for that if you are watching. But yeah, I didn't order it to here just because of the postage delays over here. So dad will bring it over for me in a couple of weeks. But I did see a couple of subscribers came in with them on. I did look at the quality and everything. They are exactly what I wanted. Look at that for a lovely view. No no signal dropouts today as well, which is nice so far. Touch wood. So that is all Fania Bay Beach there. It runs all the way along. Four hours we've been on for, I think. Oh boy, wow. That's four now. Four hours. Three hours. Three hours, 15. So I'd say two and a half hours to be walking. Yeah. Let's have a quick look at the, uh, there's a little blowhole down here. See if it's doing anything today. Ah, yes it is. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Good timing. Got a little blowhole out the rocks there. It's taped off. But if you come on a bit of a choppier day, a bit of a wavy day, there you go. Look at that. Way. Hey, hey, look at that. <laughs> I can feel that. I can feel some of the, uh, some of the, spray, off some of the spray hitting, yeah. Just get it on camera. That's really going today. I know last time we were here, we had to wait for like half an hour, didn't we? And then you've got Lagomera there. Our villa, we're not really living in there at the moment. We've chosen to live in something a little bit bigger for now. It was a bit getting a bit small for us. So we have moved out with the castle for a little bit. <laughs> I wish. Look at that. It's gonna, oh, we're going to get wet here, Laura. Coming straight at us. <laughs> the wind is blowing that sea salt spray Ooh. right on us. Oh, there you go. Oh. <laughs> so guys, if you're hot, come down here and just chill. It is really cool that, and that is completely natural. Really cool. Just love the views from up here. We've got jet skis all the way back to Las Americas over there on the left. The blowhole, La Gamera, our castle. Lovely Laura. <laughs> I'll get one more shot, see if it goes off for us one more time before we go. Uh, it's like being there, watching you walk. Time doesn't matter. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us. Is it going to go again? No, no. You've got to wait for the right sort of wave to come in. They've gone right down to view it. I'll do that one day. Get right down there. Has. Calm down. We need a wave to roll in. There we go. Went a little bit then. Very cool. Very cool. 
Some good information on the whales here as well. If you did see my video last week, this uh, is unfortunately what was uh, washed up in uh, Los Cristianos. The sperm whale had uh, rope around its mouth. Uh, we did see this, an Eden's whale. We saw that on the uh, muscat trip that we did a couple of weeks ago. Again, that is on the channel. Uh, we saw the pilot whales. We saw the bottlenose dolphin. And we saw the spotted dolphin as well. And these are all known for this area in the Canaries. We are here at the Canary Islands and it's these sort of areas that they like. So there you go. We do very occasionally as well. It's been odd times in the winter. We have had killer whales knocking around as well, uh, rolling through the orcas. Now that would be amazing to see. Uh, a few very lucky people on some boat trips got to see them. They do occasionally roll through in the, uh, in the winter. Love all this work that they've done. They've not completed it yet, but I think this is, this is fab. Really improves the promenade, this. All this stonework and planters. This will all be planted up nice. Just makes it even nicer to look out. Uh, Shane, thank you very much. Excellent stuff. Um, you can't park all your cars in that place. I much prefer watching your stream than doing the housework. Good stuff, Mum. Oh, what a walk. What a walk. Really enjoyed that. So I might grab a quick drink from this stall here and then we'll uh, carry on up towards the car. Just had to cancel my work appointments. Now you are still on. <laughs> Any more Florida vlogs to come? There'll be one tomorrow and Saturday. Uh, we've got a few left before we finish. Finish the Florida vlogs. Oh, it's gonna be sad. We'll grab a little, quick little uh, bottle of drink from here. They do, yeah, they do some little um, cocktail things and stuff. Hi, are you okay? Having a good time? Yeah. Yeah. Nice, you're in the Victoria, Victoria, yeah? Very nice, are you liking it? Spot on. Yeah, <laughs> I wish I could. Have you been to the rooftop yet? Lovely, isn't it? Very, very nice. Yeah, good. Yeah, very nice. Not bad. Yeah. Ah, okay. So you got nice views from that one. Yeah. Very nice. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it then. Yes, thank you very much, you too. Have a great day. Thank you. I love your watch as well. Thank you very much. I wish, I wish. Thank you very much. Oh, lovely couple there. They saw the video of the GF Victoria and they've gone and stayed in there. That's what I mean. Why aren't other hotels letting us film? You know, GF, doing well there. Lovely hotel that, GF Victoria. I highly recommend that rooftop bar as well. Even if you're not staying there just for some drinks. Well, I'm not going to go for any mojitos or anything like that. I've got milkshake here as well. Just a, a bottle of Aquarius or a Diet Coke would do me. Okay, so we're gonna sit here actually. It's glad, I'm glad we've got some signal. More great views. Thoroughly enjoyable. Thank you, Andrew and Laura. Thanks very much. Okay, let's grab a seat. Oof. Oh, this is a nice little spot. That's a nice little, uh, nice little spot. This never been in here. That'll do me. Remind me next time how long this walk is. Yeah. How much is it? Five euros. So you always have cash with you. This place doesn't take cards, so that's why if, if people ask me, should I bring a bit? Of, should I bring any cash? Bring a little bit with you. Little places like this uh, don't do any. Oh. Oh. 
Mm. Oh, nice. Oh, that hits the spot. <laughs> hits the spot. What time are we on? 25 past. 25 past. Got a little bit of time. We've got to walk up to the car. Ooh, that's a big wave rolling in. Oh, no. Ooh, I missed that one. That was big. Uh, well done on a great walk. Thank you very much. If you have enjoyed it, my, the only thing I ask is just to hit the thumbs up button, the like button. Ooh. If you are new as well, make sure you subscribe. Breaking up a little bit might happen in this area, unfortunately. It looks like we are breaking up a little bit, unfortunately. Sharon Newton, thank you very much. Fantastic walk. Uh, thank you, Andrew and Laura. Thank you very much, Sharon. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Thanks for sticking with us as well. I uh, really appreciate it. We'll put that towards some of the uh, some of the food vlogs that people want coming up. Um, quite a lot of people wanted some cheap restaurants, so we'll go and do that this yeah. week, next week. We'll go and do some yeah. 8.95, three courses and stuff. Uh, cheap bars as well, cheapest cocktails. Yeah. So we're going to do some of this. Find them. Yeah. We're going to do some. Yeah. Maybe with your mum and dad as well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Getting mum and dad drunk on screen. It's, uh, we'll do some of them. We might do some live, we might do some edited. Uh, love you two, really enjoyed the vlog. Thank you very much. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, how's it going over there? I went to Los Cristianos in 2017. And me and my family are coming back soon. It's all good, Dylan. Very much back to normal um, over here now. Got hurt. You all right there? I've got a piece of hair. I don't know where it, there it is. And it was just itching my face. Just one little strand of hair. There you go. Oh. Much needed. Make sure you stay hydrated if you're out here, guys. Make sure you stay hydrated. Yeah, that wind's deceiving, isn't it? Very, very. I mean, if there was no wind, you'd be melting because the breeze is keeping you cool all the time. Yeah. It's uh, melting yeah, hot. Someone just said to the GF clan after the vlog. There you go. Thank you very much. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Um, Uh, welcome to you, Paula. How's it going? Any government updates yet? Oh, you haven't yeah. got any Wi-Fi to check, have we? No. Um, I don't think so. If anyone knows, if anyone can check Canarian Weekly, if there's any announcements, but I think it will come later tonight. Yeah, they'll only come after five. Sometimes later, sometimes the news comes out about seven, eight o'clock at Ooh. night. It depends how long their meetings go on for. Yeah. Um, just to bear in mind, that if they do announce it tonight, even if they said tonight that masks were finishing, it will be from a certain date. It won't be imminently. And uh, do you have to put the, the official bulletin out yeah. as well? Which is which will at least be next week, Monday, I'd say. At least they might say in two weeks' time we're going to relieve the masks. We don't know, but whatever they announce tonight, it will still be a bit of time before it happens. Yeah. Uh, it won't be anything imminent. It won't be like from tonight. Personally, I can't see the masks going, but I can see them easing restrictions even more. Well, this is Maybe. a specific meeting about masks. Oh, is it just, just about masks? Yeah. A specific meeting, particularly to do with masks. And he does keep saying three times now, he said it's, it's very soon, very soon, yeah, very soon. Yeah, so, yeah, I said it's sooner rather than later than masks ago. He said very yeah. soon, two or three weeks ago, so. Yeah. We could very well get a date tonight, keep it out. I'll still be wearing mine inside, indoors, though. How much would you bring per person for self-catering? Very good question, Guy. It all depends on... If you're doing excursions, are you a big drinker? Do you like cocktails? Are you? We spend a bit less on the likes of cocktails and drinks, but then we spend more on excursions when we go away. It just depends. I don't know. It depends where you're going to be eating. Are you going to be eating in more fancier restaurants? Are you going to be more 8 95 a little bit cheaper? It's, mm. it's too broad of a question, really. <laughs> tricky, tricky question. It just depends how much you want to, really. Yeah. I'm trying to think how much we brought when we first came on holiday. Because I, I, I'm used to budget and pay a day. I've always budget pay a day. But well, back then it probably would have been about 500 euros for a week. Mm. Something like that. Yeah. But then, you know, you do a boat trip, that's like 30, 40 quid gone. Then, you know, meal, lunch, breakfast, drinks, you know, 100 a day gone. Yeah. Just depends. Depends how much you want to do, really. I mean, you can do it very cheap. You can just chill at the beach take drinks with you from the supermarket little 8.95 meal or eat in the apartment you can do it as cheap as you want and you can do it as expensive as you want really yeah. oh nice yeah. very nice that uh, 100 a day yeah book excursions before you go yeah 100 a day i think sounds about right that yeah 
that's a hundred pounds a day so at the moment yeah so I'm looking at these waves crashing in I'm gonna show you them in a second I'll tell you what 200 minutes we've been on for <laughs> thank you all for sticking in we've still got 700 tuned in as well so surprised you ain't been striked yet singing along to all the songs and I'll probably go ding ding I'll be driving the airport be like ding YouTube ding YouTube <laughs> Uh, we spent 700 euros self-catering out every night in Las Americas. There you go. No news yet in the Canarian Weekly. Okay, thanks, Mum. Nothing. Nothing yet. As soon as it happens, I'll film a little news update for everyone anyway. Um, no problem. I imagine it'll be tonight. It's interesting though, isn't it? Will be. Will be. We're going in the right direction. Yeah. Well, I put you in Florida, hundreds a day, don't I? And then whatever which in, which in Florida doesn't really touch the sides. No, but then what I don't no it does because I'll have days where I don't spend too much where mm. you only spend money on eating out one in a Yeah, evening. when I pay for dinner, yeah. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, my oh, I'm a hundred to you know, it does alright, yeah. Andrew <laughs> pays for breakfast and dinner. No, no, and, and you no. know, Mickey snacks and you know, your money goes really far. No. <laughs> it does I take around a hundred a day and then some days, because when we're with your family, we eat in up for breakfast every morning, don't we? Yeah. And then we don't we do not do two big meals a day, typically do we? we but do. then bear in mind, that 100 a day, that, that's excluding park tickets, yeah. which you've already paid for. So that's 100 a day, it's just like spendies, as in like food, drink, you know, shopping and stuff. That's not including park tickets, etc. Always go with more than you need, 100% if you can, take a little bit more. 88 days and counting. You're not that you're counting though, Andy. <laughs> uh, great to have you on. I hope you're well. Um, would you go to the Tenerife FC game? Can do. Love the Ocean Car team. We'll love them. They will do. Fantastic. Absolutely brilliant. Right, we're going to carry on walking. Let's uh, carry on making a move. Carry on. Andrew pays. <laughs> bring your can. You can bring your can, can't you? Okay. I don't pay me weight anyway. Now, Laura does. I am joking. I am joking. Look at these waves now. These have come out of nowhere. Very nice. Okay, we're going to carry on walking up towards the car. Have you been to Aqualand? I haven't. Personally, we, we prefer Siam Park, but for younger kids, Aqualand might be a little bit better. Um, never really done Aqualand. Oh, <laughs> I'll sleep tonight. I will sleep tonight. We're up early tomorrow. Very early. Very early. We've got a delivery in Calio, Slovakia at eight in the morning before Laura goes to her cleaning job. So no exercise for me tomorrow? No. Another delivery where we got that one afterwards. Uh, over next week for a week, staying local this time. Very nice, have a fantastic time. Uh, Laura is the financial planning consultant. <laughs> Me and my partner are coming for the first time in June for 10 days. Looking, enjoying the videos, thank you very much. Uh, we will be back to overseas Chinese soon as well. We love it in there. We'll be back there soon. Yeah. Del Duque shopping centre here now. Down there is the beach. I'm not going to manage to make it that far today. Little legs. <laughs> Little legs are struggling. Where's the car parked again, Laura? Del Duke Centre. This is Del Duke Centre. Do the one Duke Shopping Centre. Duke Shopping Centre we're parked at, okay. The far end. Oh, couldn't you have got it any closer? No. <laughs> you were say for spot, weren't we? How are you getting home? We uh, strategically left the car here earlier. So we've dropped the car off and we've walked all the way to it now. So we're going to drive home in that car 
no way we could walk back. We're going to be going straight to the airport now. Uh, up with two cars, back in one more. And then chill, I think. <laughs> These shops always smell lovely, don't they? No. They always smell like, they always have nice, uh, like, aftershave-ish smells. Because the, the nice. shops. It does smell nice. It is, does smell nice. I'll admit that. I've never been in any of these shops. Did all your Christian Dior and Gucci and stuff. Very nice. Posh shops. Boy, oh boy. Another great job well done. Thanks very much, Tony. Take away for tea. Um, no, and I think we're done. We've got, oh, we've got steaks. There we go. Got steaks. We won't be having that till later, though. I've just had a huge ham and cheese yeah. toasty. Well, you can have just one of the steaks. <laughs> and some rice. Not till later, though, about yeah. half seven, eight. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> I might have chicken salad drop for tea. Chicken salad wrap, eh? What is everyone else having for tea? Let me know. We've got 728 tuned in. What is everyone having for dinner? Anything exciting? Is anyone having a ham and cheese toasty after watching that? <laughs> <laughs> Does not quite the same when you make it yourself in your own house. No. Gloomy England weather. Oh, I'm struggling now. <laughs> Kippers for tea. Another great YouTube vlog. You guys are smashing the YouTube with great content. Thank you very much. Plenty more to come. Oh, someone's having a chili toasty omelette. These are nice hotels. These, these are all five star. Very nice hotels. Beans on toast. Not many exciting options going on here. <laughs> Take away KFC. Oh, my little arm. Coronation chicken chicken on jack and potatoes. That's a bit popular, is it? That sounds nice. You probably like coronation chicken, although no, it's cold. So you wouldn't. Yeah, I like it warm. Yeah, you wouldn't like it. Uh, the more I see, the more I think I have made a mistake. Booking our holiday, everything seems to be so so far and looks very costly i don't think so i think it'll be fine i wouldn't judge it just off this video this is just a long walk that we do once every few months um as a special one off you wouldn't normally walk this far this is just us walking through three towns to show it off um it is quite easy to get around there's taxis there's buses etc Have you watched Camper Vibe YouTube channel? I haven't, so I will check it out, Mick. I haven't had much chance to watch YouTube lately. <laughs> Loads to catch up on, yeah. I've been really busy the last few days. Ardina's de Navaria, very nice hotel. Lovely fountain and flowers out the front. Better for sit down. <laughs> I know you're relaxing the car, won't you? I know. I tell you what, we'll sit out tonight. Definitely. This is it all refurbished. If you remember this one, they've got a lovely rooftop there as well with hammocks on. Opens up in the evening, that rooftop for the, public. The, the rooftop can go on that, uh, the public can go on that rooftop of an evening, Laura was saying. Yeah. Um, it's called the Atom Hotels. Now, well, it's run by Atom. It's very nice inside, I've been inside, I've done it all myself, lovely. Laura's been in. 
and it, it had been in reception as well. Delivered the car, it was very nice. Well, you've got like, sort of, like five pools. Five pools in there. Like that, yeah. Kids play area and everything. The San Miguel shopping centre here has had a bit of a facelift, I noticed. I think they put some new signage up and freshened it up a little. Used to be Isla Bonita, yes, that's the one. They have done it very nice. Much better. If you do want to see reviews of any of some of these hotels, they are on the channel. We've done the GF Isabel, we've done the GF Gran, GF Victoria, all in this area. Uh, so if you are looking for hotels in this area, I have got reviews on the channel of those. Give you an idea of what the rooms are like. This is very Canarian themed, this one. I think they've done that up. Nice new signage, San Miguel Shopping Centre. Looks a little bit nicer there, yeah. yeah. Painted it a bit. Looks much nicer. Yeah, if you can smash the thumbs up, I'd really appreciate it. Oh, I can see our little car there. Can you see our little Wait, car? Where's our little car? You don't know where to park. Oh, right over there. Yeah. I can see it now. Our little panda awaits. Like I said, it's our little jabby little spot. <laughs> I didn't know it was a spot until I was right on top of it. So I think we'll finish it off here with a nice bit of palm trees in the background. We've done 212 minutes, very long. But I hope you did all enjoy it. If you watched it on catch up, if you watched it live, thank you all so much. Thanks to the admins as well, great work. Um, everyone who joined us, uh, everyone who came and said hello as well, was brilliant. Really enjoyed that. Yeah. Long walk, but that covers all the areas for now. Gives you a good idea of what areas are busy, what areas are busiest. I'd say Adeki was slightly quieter, but not much. Yeah, not nothing no. like, oh, I wouldn't want to stay there. Um, all very, very good. Uh, but thank you all so much. If you can, hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe if you are new. There is loads on the channel, completely free. Loads of live streams, loads of excursions, etc. Check out nightstrider.com. You can get some discounts on there as well. And it makes you follow us both on Instagram. It's the other thing. Yeah. You posted some funny videos today. Yeah. Laura's doing a few funny little videos. I post little bits of what we're up to throughout the day. So uh, make sure you check those out. Uh, and for now, we will uh, see you tomorrow. I'm not sure which vlog it'll be, but uh, we'll see. See what happens. Stride on, guys. Thank you very much. Next live stream will definitely be on Sunday, potentially even one on Saturday. Comment below where you'd like us to go and what you'd like us to do. Uh, but thank you very much. Stride on and uh, enjoy the rest of your day.